UK on Facebook. Get interactive with Jewelry Maker. There are two easy ways to purchase from Jewelry Maker. You can watch our show on Sky, Virgin, Freeview or Freesat and call our free phone number where you'll be put through to our friendly help team who can place your order. Alternatively, you can go to our website and click the sign up button. Once you have filled in the required details, you can start shopping. You can watch the show by clicking the on air now button on the front page. You can also use our quick search tool and narrow down your results. Once you have found an item that you like, you simply click on the buy now button and the item will be added to your basket. Don't forget that you can add as many items to your basket per day for only one p and p Enjoy shopping with Jewelry Maker. to jewelry maker jewelry maker la la jewelry maker la la jewelry maker la la jewelry jewelry maker take it over linda la la jewelry maker la la, la jewelry maker Oh, that was nice. Thanks. <laughs> How you doing? Ooh. There we go. Welcome to Jewelry Maker. I'm Caroline with you for the next four hours with the lovely Linda. Morning. There she is. Have you had a nice few days? Uh, yes, yes, yes. Busy, hot, but nice. Thank Busy, you. hot. I yeah. know. It is a bit warm at the minute, isn't it? Sure is. Are you finding it easy to sleep? No. Oh, gosh. No, no neither am I. No. It's no. too warm, isn't it? It's a bit too warm. Yeah, but we shouldn't complain. We shouldn't change. complain, Lindy. You're change. right, because if it was cold, we would be complaining, <laughs> yeah. wouldn't we? Look, it looks like we've got a lovely workshop with us. I don't know who the workshop are today. We've got a lovely workshop with us today. I think it's Angela with the Business Academy. There's a, there's a few ladies in there. Yeah. Oh, is it for the Business Academy, I wonder? I reckon it might be for the Business Academy. I don't know. Got three lovely ladies in there nattering away. There we go. We have got, who have we got with us today? We've got the lovely Linda with us today, of course. We've got the lovely Cassandra with us today. Kathy! Come on, Cass. Come on, Cass. Whoa, uh, whoa, 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 whoa. No, no, no. You don't go to that camera, Kelsey. You come to camera one. Here she is, everyone. The delectable. Woo, Kathy! <laughs> oh yeah! Oh yeah! We got Coral with us today. He's on work experience. Coral, come and give us a wave on camera one. Here she is. She is lovely. There we go. We got the lovely Ollie with us today. Hi, Ollie. And we've got <laughs> Laura. Come on, Laura. You know you're oh, she's having a good old flash of her graphics there. There we go. And we've got Ryan. Ryan. Hello. There's Ryan. How are you today, Ryan? Yeah, well, not wearing your shorts today. No. Why not? Well, Can you wear your shorts tomorrow, please? Okay. I like your, your your checkered shorts. They're really nice. They're really nice checkered shorts and sneakers. <laughs> there we go. Fantastic. Right. Um, we've got an amazing show for you today. We have got loads and loads and loads. We've got um, fantastic gems of distinction, brand new strands. We've got a fantastic early bird. We've got an amazing challenge to give to the lovely Linda as well. We've got the most incredible deluxe Jenny Wynn bead scoop I think I've ever seen in my life. That's going to be coming your way. Um, during the show, we've got the storage bag. We've got loads of amazing bundles. We've got three amazing kits. We've got more amazingness than you can shake a stick at. <laughs> There's a stick. The stick. The stick! There's Ryan with his stick. No, put it away now. Put, it away. put your stick away, Ryan. Mad. <laughs> barking! Bark! <laughs> bark, barking. 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 Bark. <gasps> uh, should we branch out a little bit? <laughs> <laughs> Leave it alone. <laughs> 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 Can't think of any more. No, normally. <laughs> Stick to the day job. Stick what? Stick to the day job. Stick to the day job. 
<laughs> right. Right. Should we, should we have a look at the early bird? The early bird special today is special. How you doing, early bird? How you doing, early bird? The early bird special today is special because it is all about cord. Uh, very, very recently, like over the last few weeks, we've had um, a fantastic delivery of cord. Um, the early bird special is always going to be something which you kind of have to get involved with, you want to get involved with, um, and it's going to be something which is just totally, totally, totally unmissable. Um, now, today's early bird is all to do with cord. It is literally call, called Maypole with Cord. And it's taken me all my strength today not to rig up some kind of a maypole experience in the show. I think we've actually done that before. Ryan, have I, I think I've, I've wrapped you, I've done a maypole around you with ribbon before. Was it with you? I think you probably would remember that. I think you probably you? would. Yeah, I think, I've, I think I have done a maypole around, around somebody in the studio with ribbon before and it all got a little bit messy. Uh, but anyway, so, um, We've got satin cord here. Now, satin cord, fantastic for fantastic for your knitting, your uh, crochet, your macrame, your kumihimoing. It really, really is absolutely superb with um, whatever kind of knotting medium you want. You are going to be getting ten lots here. No, ten uh, ten meter ten meter spools here of satin cord. Ten meter spools. So you're going to be getting ten meters of green. 10 meters of blue, 10 meters of light blue, 10 meters of gold, 10 meters of black, 10 meters of silver, and 10 meters of red. So that is 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70 meters of satin cord. Now, the great thing about having 10 meter spools as opposed to having uh, two meter lengths or five meter lengths is the fact that, yes, of course, you're going to be getting more. But also, if you want to make your um, if you want to make your um, your uh, necklaces, if you want to make those longer pieces, then uh, then then of course you can do because these are ten meter spools. Have we got are there eight? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. What? Are, which one are we missing? Yellow. We're missing yellow. Because orange is there. We're missing yellow. Yellow. Yellow to the front desk. <laughs> <laughs> Well, the yellow spool of satin cord make its way to the front desk, please. You are required for a game. Is it not here? No, we're missing yellow. We've got orange. It's either orange or yellow we're missing, basically. You're going to be getting eight, so 80 metres here. I tell you what, I tell you, you can't get the staff these days. I've got to tell you what, we put these bundles together. I don't know why we bother. Don't know why we bother. We need to get a price out now anyway for these. Um, so you're going to be getting 80 metres, not 70, you're going to be getting 80. So just imagine there's one more there. It's either yellow or orange. And we can't decide whether this is yellow or orange, basically. Uh, do try this out. Give us a call on our free phone number, which is 0800 644 655, or get involved on our website, jewelrymaker.com. Copy and paste that code uh, at the top of the screen, YQGC62, into our website. Um, and it's yours after you check out your basket. Here's your deal today. Seven pounds and ninety-five p for eighty meters of satin cord. That is eight lots of ten meters of satin cord. There's going to be another spool with this as well. I'm ever so sorry that we haven't got it here in the studio, but there are eighty meters you're going to be getting for under eight pounds. Well done. So give us a call now. It is a free phone number from a BT landline, or you can get involved on our website, which is jewelrymaker.com. What are you going to be getting with your order? A thirty-day money-back guarantee. Yeah, free, free. Yeah. You're only paying 2.95 p and p per order. That is for the whole day. That lasts for uh, today on the day show between nine and one, uh, and also on the late show between five and nine. Um, you are also going to be getting a number of things free with your first order, including a free tutorial DVD, which is an hour long. An hour long. Get started with jewelry maker DVD with loads of tutorials and hints and tips on it. Fantastic to get you started with your jewelry making hobby. You also get a get started with jewelry maker booklet, which has got lots of information there about our threading materials like wire and elastic and satin cord. Information in here about our findings as well, um, including bolt ring clasps, uh, jump rings, crimp beads, earring findings, etc., etc. Lots of information about our learning library and our starter kits, and also there are tutorials at the back of this booklet as well, which is just fantastic. So, 
you've got two lots of information there which you can learn from also there's information in our workshop and tutorial booklet which is free with your first order as well which gives you information about all of our workshops here at jewelry maker you can make the most of our facebook page where there are over 13,000 jewelry makers our youtube channel our website and you can watch our live shows as well. There is a plethora of information out there for you to take advantage of. There really, really is. So $7.95 for 80 meters of satin cord. Why don't you make a maypole with it? I'd definitely make a maypole with it. Um, so, so under eight pounds, give us a call when you can or get involved on our website. If you want to multi-buy anything, so if you want to get two or three or four or five of anything, just speak to the call center or live help. And if the quantity is there, you can absolutely um, uh, get involved uh, with more than one of these if you want to. Just go for it. Well done. Bit of a queue on the phone lines at the minute, but not much. Call center is dealing really well with it. So uh, just be patient. Uh, don't forget it is a free phone number from a BT landline. Well done. Isn't that great? Isn't that great? Now. I want to apologise as well. I'm going to make an apology. It's very early in, on in the show, isn't it? I want to apologise. Normally, before every single show that I'm on air, I update my Facebook page. Carol Roach. C-A-R-O-L-R-O-A-C-H-E. Uh, if you want to... You'll have to get my name, Linda. Um, sorry, You'll have to get my name. I heard you laugh then. You'll I have to get my I name. I just didn't actually know why you spelt it. Because how, well, how would you spell Roach? Oh. Exactly. Okay. R O A C H E. Cockroach. Exactly. Back end of cockroach. Yes, it? all right. It's cockroach, but without the bit on the front. All right. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> So it's Carol Roach, and I normally update my Facebook page at the beginning of every show. Um, today I didn't. I'm sorry. There is a really good reason for it, and it's to do with this Deluxe Gem selection, which is coming up later on in the show. It's to do with this. This is coming up later on in the show, and it's because of this Deluxe Gem selection that I didn't update my Facebook page today, and I'm very, very, very sorry. I hope you can find it in your heart to forgive me. I promise to upload two amusing pictures of dogs swimming underwater tomorrow. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Right. We're going to challenge Linda. Linda, you're up for a challenge today. Sure am. Brill. Please. You're not just going to take the mickey out of me all day, are you? I'll do my best not to. But it's tempting. <laughs> oh, she's funny, isn't she? <laughs> so, we've got challenge Linda, challenge, challenge Linda. I don't know what is it. I don't know why I've got that song in my head. <laughs> I don't know. Right, Linda. We are going to challenge you. <laughs> We're going to challenge you with a bundle, which I can see she's already started working with. Jesus. <laughs> Just act like you're surprised. Just pretend you haven't seen it, all right? Where did that come from, Carol? Oh, I don't ever wow. do it. Don't ever do it. So, <laughs> pink coloured shell pearl plain rounds. These are six millimetres in diameter. This is what you get when you got um, shell and you reform it into a pearl shape. Now you want to get that perfect pearl shape and you still want to have that gorgeous pearl essence. Um, this is really one of the only ways that you can get that perfect pearl shape is by going for shell pearl. It's a really, really lovely strand, this one. Light pink shell pearl, six millimeter plain rounds. Gorgeous, gorgeous strands here. So absolutely beautiful. You're also going to be getting slightly larger shell pearls here. These are eight mil rounds and a slightly different color as well. More of a dusty pink, which I really like. So dusty pink shell pearls as well. And these are eight millimetres in diameter. So really, really beautiful strands here. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. You're then going to be getting another strand of genuine gemstones here. Mystic silver quartz. Oh, this is beautiful. Um, in any kind of bridal boutique, in any kind of um, 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 occasion where I think silver mystic quartz looks absolutely beautiful. These are four mil plain rounds here. Um, can you see how beautifully those colours go together? They really do look awesome together, don't they? Silvers with light pinks with slightly darker pinks. They look gorgeous, don't they? Now, you are not only going to be getting your three genuine gemstone strands, you are also going to be getting 15 metres of silver plated copper wire. 
Now this is precious metal plated wire, okay? So it's silver plated copper wire, 0.6 millimeters in gauge, which is really interesting. Once you have 0.6 millimeter gauge wire, you start to be able to do things like make your own findings, make your own jump rings, make your own earring findings out of it. 15 meters of it here, so more than enough to make um, um, your own gemstone chain, your own earring findings, your own clasps maybe even. You can start to work hard on this kind of wire as well, which is really lovely. You're also going to be getting, and honestly, I do not know where on earth these have been. I think they're literally just back in stock. You are going to be getting a pack of one, two, three, four, five hair slides. Five silver colored hair slides. Now, there are five of these in total, perfect for making tiaras, perfect for making, of course, hair vines, uh, for making um, um, any kind of hair clip, any kind of bridal quality. If you're, if you're going to be making maybe a little hair slide for maybe your daughter or your, or your uh, niece to wear to maybe a ballet exam or, um, or to a party or to a prom, you know, something like that. Mm. It, it's, it's a really, really fantastic um, um, accessory to have. These always sell out on Jewelry Maker. We've only literally just got them back in stock because they always, 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 always sell out. You can make your own, but it's but it can be quite laborious. Um, um, having these ready, having these ready to use, having these blanks ready to use is just fantastic. Now, we are going to be giving you an amazing price on this today, obviously. This is going to be Linda's challenge today. And I can't wait to see what she makes with these. With the 0.6 millimeter gauge wire, silver plate to copper wire, three strands of gemstones, and five of your uh, silver colored hair slides as well. Your deal today is incredible. Get involved as quickly as you can, purely because these things like these always, always, always sell out on Jewelry Maker. Here's your price today. Under 13 pounds. Now, when you have the opportunity to make things like hair slides, things like fascinators, things for uh, maybe little ones to wear um, uh, during ballet exams, etc., etc. Um, you have the opportunity to maybe sell them on or maybe to give them away as gifts. If you do sell hair slides like this on, couldn't you make maybe a beautiful little hair slide, um, um, put some of these gorgeous gemstones on there, use some of the wire and maybe sell it for, oh, I don't know, 10, 12 pounds. The whole bundle here the whole bundle here, you could easily make your money back just by selling one of these. You really, really could do. Now, Linda, what, what are your ideas for this um, for this bundle? Because you've got some lovely, lovely um, features here, haven't you? Yes, I mean, the shell pearl's absolutely beautiful. It's so girly, so mm. feminine. And then the, with the mystic silver quartz, we've got that fantastic four mil bead that I always enjoy having. Yeah. Because you can do such a lot with them. Um, I mean, I'm amazed at the price, to be truthful. I didn't expect it was going to be that low because I was looking at combs, and these are so well made. Y yeah. You said that you can make your own, which you can. You really, really can. But these have more structure to them. Yes. Um, they don't bend quite so much as perhaps if you did make your own. Um, so you can put sort of more stress on them. Mm. Um, and they'll last longer, obviously. Yes. Um, but I saw one of these in a... Um, a small craft shop the other day, 150 each. The oh, really? Were. Just for the blanks? Yeah, yeah, just for the blank combs. So that, that was 150 each, and I think it was £6.50 for five or something like that. Um, so it is, considering you've got some shell pearl and you've got the silver plated copper wire, that is one dish of a bargain. So really, if, 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 if these combs were 150 each, that would be what, £7.50, £8 just for yeah. the combs on their own. Then of course you've got the gemstones and the wire as well. The 0.6mm gauge wire, is it going to work with, is it going to work with a challenge like this, do you think, Linda? Yes, yeah, certainly. I mean, um, the 0.6 is probably the level at which you start to think about using for structure. Yeah, of course. Yeah. You've got the wire twister, you can get some really serious um, structure going on as mm. well by twisting perhaps two or three of them. Um, but it just uh, lets you build on the comb yeah. and it's not going to flop. Yeah. You know, whatever decoration you want. If you want something like a, um, a long sort of um, waterfall coming down, you, it, it, it gives you the opportunity of putting something in place where you want it to stay. Yeah, lovely. As opposed to it. But then obviously if you want something that's a little bit more fluid, then use a 0.4. But 0.6 is that happy medium between yeah. the 8 and the 4. And, and you don't necessarily need to use the combs, do you? I mean, no, it, no, no, it's no, going to no. make beautiful jewellery as well, exactly. isn't it? Exactly. Yeah, well, this. I mean, you mentioned a hair vine. Mm. I mean, really, you don't need... Uh, if you want to make hair pieces, you don't need... To have a comb or a tiara band to make a hair vine. Mm. 
So, uh, yeah, there's a lot of potential. Yeah, um, fantastic. So that's your challenge today, Linda. Brilliant. You've been Love very it. kind to you with your challenge you today, actually. Okay, very gentle. I was planning on giving you um, a piece of cheese and a, uh, and a three-pin plug, actually. Do you but, know what? But there I we go. made that piece of jewellery last night. Did you? I did. Yeah, I called it Cheesy Plugs. <laughs> Right, we've got some amazing strands today. What gemstone do you reckon this is? <whistles> what do you reckon this is? Ooh. Gorgeous strand of genuine eyelight coming up on the show today. Oh, oh baby, oh baby. It's gorgeous, isn't it? It really is a beautiful strand. Look at those gorgeous colors. The most amazing player chrism going through this amazing um, gems of distinction strand of highlights, all hand faceted, a beautiful, beautiful strand coming your way. We've also got, and I haven't seen this for ages on Jewelry Maker, green amethyst. It seems like weeks and weeks and weeks since we've had um, any green amethyst in stock. This beautiful strand of crystal clear. Praseolite is going to be coming your way. Look at the clarity. Can you see the quality on this strand? And how many of them there are on there? It's like a traffic jam of Praseolite. It's beautiful. One of the best strands of multicolour beryl I think I've ever seen on Jewelry Maker. This is gorgeous. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful strands here. Featuring Morganite. You've got a beautiful strand of multicolour beryl on today's show. The clarity is just delicious. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Uh, we've also got another very, very unusual variety of Heliodor. Sorry, of Heliodor, of, of, of uh, yellow beryl. This is Heliodor, the most beautiful, sumptuous colours here. A stunning strand of canary yellow Heliodor. This is, oh, this is Heliodor. It's beautiful, isn't it? beautiful strand there and we've also got a genuine strand of amethyst as well the most stunning colors we bought you a strand of amethyst hearts yesterday which would go really really beautifully with this don't you think the colors are almost exactly the same actually beautiful strand of amethyst faceted rounds as well gorgeous 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 right um now we've also got coming up on today's show this is going to be really exciting. This Gelux Gem Selection, which features gemstones like Peridot, Appetite, Rose Quartz, Smoky Quartz, Carnelian, White Quartz, Lemon Quartz, Fluorite, you name it, it is in there basically. This is one of the most varied gem selections I think I've ever bought you on Jewelry Maker. It's beautiful. The price point is unbelievable. It really is sensational. Now we do have loads and loads and loads of different bundles coming up today we've got some uh we've got some um gemstone bundles we've got some bundles which are going to be more about tools uh we've got three amazing kits today as well which are just really really fantastic but we're going to start off with a gorgeous bundle which is going to give you sorry really these ones oh 925 sterling silver oh these are amazing hardly ever see these on jm these are ribbon endings okay these are ribbon endings or cord endings and these are 925 sterling silver you're getting three of these now the lobster claw clasp you can see here if i just pick that up is 925 sterling silver the chain, the extended chain on there, is 925 sterling silver. And you're also going to be getting on either end one of these little fold over clasps, which is what you put things like your leather cord in, your satin cord, your hemp cord, your ribbon. That is 925 sterling silver. Now, we don't very often bring you these clasps in 925 sterling silver. Generally, they're going to be silver plated copper or some kind of um, base metal, um, um, uh, maybe plated with a precious metal. This is 925 sterling silver. Um, the great thing about this is if you are going to be making, oh, I don't know, beautiful kumahimo pieces or macrame pieces, which feature gemstones, which are very precious to you, 
then you want to use that beautiful precious metal quality. Not only that, but giving your customers um, uh, the the option of having their pieces of jewelry, their kumihimo, their threaded pieces, whatever, however you're going to use these, made up with precious metal finings, because there are lots of people who are allergic to certain base metal finings and that maybe they can only wear precious metal, giving them the option of adding on a precious metal extender chain and cord ending quality and lobster claw clasp, being able to add that onto your jewellery is, is just fantastic. Giving them the option of adding that onto their pieces is really, really fantastic. You don't see clasps and extended chains like this very often in precious metal, I have to say. Um, lobster claw clasps, yeah, you do, and, and, and even chain, but not with the fold over clasps. Sorry, not with the fold over ends. As well as having your three clasps in there, you're also going to be getting orange satin cord 10 meters of orange satin cord 10 meters of silver colored satin cord 10 meters of emerald green colored satin cord 10 meters of baby blue colored satin cord as well um what do you what what do you like about what well, do you like the satin cord Linda? yes i absolutely love it i mean i use it um a lot for i do very limited amounts of, of macrame but it's mm. great for that because it just slides beautifully yeah so it allows you basically to sort of make bigger loops in the macrame because it'll slide then up the um, up the lazy cord nicely um but for crochet it's just brilliant it I makes a it nice is. neat crochet stitch yeah, I bet it is. It's, it's, it's one of those cords that's very, very substantial. It's very, very smooth. As, as Linda says, when you're making pieces, especially with sliding knots, you'll find that the satin cord works very well. There's very little friction. However, when you do start knotting it, when you do start crocheting with it, you'll find that it will stick. It does have a huge amount of strength there. Um, bringing these to you in 10 metres balls, we've only just really started to do this over the last um, uh, three or four months or so, and they've always been very, very popular. So you're going to be getting 40 meters of satin cord here. You're also going to be getting your three precious metal um, cord endings with extender chain and, of course, the um, lobster claw clasp in there. That's very, very unusual to get those in precious metal. And your mini Kumihimo disc as well. This is a fantastic disc to own. Um, it's, it's the same as the round disc, um, other than the fact that it's just um, that little bit smaller. So perfect to take away with you on holiday, perfect for children to use as well. If you use the larger disc, you might want to give one of these um, for one of your kids or, or grandkids to use, or if you run a, an after school club, you know, it's perfect. It's perfect for kids to use, but also great if you're going to be going away um, um, for a long journey, you're going to be going on a plane, you're going to be going on a train journey, and you don't necessarily want the big Kumihimo disc. Fantastic just to take these because you can take these on a plane. No, you know, no problem at all. You shouldn't have any problem at all. Um, there are Kumihimo demonstrations on our YouTube channel, on our website. There potentially is a uh, DVD in the pipeline as well. Um, and you will see Kumihimo de uh, um, uh, demonstrations on, uh, on, on Joey Maker. Uh, uh, quite often on Joey Maker as well. So you will never really be uh, without any kind of tutorial. You can also go to the internet and there are loads and loads and loads of tutorials on the internet as well. So you've got your mini Kumihimo disc, you've got your 40 meters of satin cord and you've got your precious metal findings. Now let's talk about these findings. These findings on their own, these three, and look at and look how well they've been crafted. These three 925 sterling silver and look at how well these clasps have been made beautiful spring-loaded clasps here you know there's nothing that that, that that we have skimped on at all with these they are very very high quality indeed these gorgeous gorgeous clasps on their own all three of them together are seven pounds and 95p now that's a fantastic price isn't it when you consider that they're precious metal you can set all the moving parts on there. I mean, that's a spring-loaded clasp in there that you're going to be getting there. Um, you're getting your 95 cents of a chain. You're going to be getting your ribbon endings on either end as well. You're getting three of them in total, which is just wonderful. So $7.95 for your precious metal clasps. Wonderful. Superb. Do you know how much your entire bundle is going to be today? So for the mini Kumihimo disc and 40 meters of satin cord, this is your price today. £11.95p. Oh my 
words. That is incredible. And don't think of this as, as a single bundle that you can't use with Jenny with gemstones, because you can. You can even use um, some of the gems of distinction strands that we're going to be bringing you today. Well, how can you do that? OK, well, if you make your lazy cord, if you're going to be doing um, um, uh, macrame, if you make your lazy cord beading thread, then you will undoubtedly be able to use um, uh, those gemstones on your, um, sorry, you will undoubtedly be able to thread your gemstones onto that beading thread. If you're going to be kumihimoing, if you're going to be kumihimoing with your, um, uh, with genuine gemstones, then you'll have your kumihimo um, um, uh, threads made out of these satin cords, and then you can um, strand gemstones onto monofilament. I mean, there are different ways in which you can incorporate all sorts of gemstones with, with satin cord, aren't there, um, oh, Linda? Yeah, absolutely. It's just a matter of. Um sort of experimenting and having a go because mm. I mean you've got plenty of cord there I yeah. mean if you don't want to go straight into cord then there's tons and tons and tons of meters of beading thread in the kits and things just yeah, have a absolutely. little practice with that before you go um, full on into the kumihimo but yeah. you know if you want to start kumihimo that's that's the purchase to make isn't I it think so. to be honest because it's all there and you can make your first strand and then think, wow, now I want to add beads to it. I want yeah. to get the larger version of it. But that is just a superb little kit to start you off. Yeah. And even if you've got gemstones that you want to use and you're thinking, yeah, but they won't go on that satin cord, that's okay. It's not insurmountable. You can start to thread the gemstones on using monofilament. You can start, you know, there are loads and loads and loads of different ways in which you can in which you can add gemstones to this. Um, and, and, and as Linda says, it's great. It, it's a great starter pack um, um, for Kumihimo because you can just simply use the cord. And because you're getting such difference in the colours of the cord, then, then it's going to be very, very easy to follow the Kumihimo basic, uh, basic uh, uh, knotting technique, uh, which you can learn by looking at our YouTube channel or looking at our website um, or going on the internet and having a look at tutorials as well. Being inspired as well by going to our Facebook page and seeing, um, and seeing the photos which people upload every single day of Kumihimo. It's just the most amazing medium, and it is so popular not just amongst adults but amongst children as well. It's so lovely gorgeous great to make friendship braces out of it's so lovely right now first brand new kit it's a brand new kit we've got a brand new kit everyone Woo -hoo! yeah Woo! yeah who made who made this first brand new kit do we know sheila sheila made it it's called shilla moments i like the sound of that Shilla moments. You're kidding. How many kits have we got today, Laura? Three kits today. How many of them are going under um, 20 pounds? Two. Two kits going under 20 pounds today. Of the three. Right. Do you want to see your first strand of genuine gemstones? Golden shell pearl, is this right? Yeah. Golden shell pearl. Absolutely gorgeous. Golden shell pearl. These are, oh, ah, ah, we've got the wrong picture of the kit. This is the right kit, but it's the wrong picture. We don't want to confuse you. We're going to do a bundle first, then we're going to start bringing you our kits. We don't want to confuse anyone. We are teasing you. We te we, it was all planned. It was all planned, by the way. It's all, it's all planned. Right. I've got a gorgeous bundle for you. It's got shell pearl, white shell pearl. This is called pure magic. Magic. Not just any magic, pure magic. So white shell pearl, that's getting, that's getting worse as the days go by, isn't it? True. It's getting more like those telephone numbers that you call, isn't it? Yeah. Sound like a heavy breather. Do you call those numbers then? No! <laughs> no, Linda, no! How do you everyone know? How knows? do you know how they sound? Oh, well, it's Carol. obvious though, isn't it? She's on the other end. Those, oh, she... Oh! Those, right. I'm not on the other end of those phone numbers. No! But you know those adverts, those food adverts for the food... 
for the supermarket. Yes. I'm st I'm always plugging to get my voice on one of those adverts, but the more I do impressions of that advert, the worse it gets. It just sounds really just it just sounds awful. Does it? So I sound like a heavy breather. It's so meant to be kind of seductive and kind of, you know, ooh, yeah, that sounds sounds <laughs> nice, but it just it just sounds awful. Pure magic. No, it's just awful. <laughs> right, okay, right. <laughs> Just ignore me. Bright white shell pearl, 10 millimeter plain rounds. These are gorgeous. These are lovely, lovely gemstones, aren't they? Really, really nice, big, bright white shell pearls. And um, they're snowy white, aren't they gorgeous? Really, really beautiful. And you get that perfect round shape as well, which you, which you just don't get with pearls unless, unless you're gonna be spending hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of pounds a strand. I've got a second strand here. Now this is described as light amethyst faceted rice beads. These are delish. Do you remember last week on last Tuesday show, we had a strand of faceted amethyst um, drops. And they were elongated drops and uh, both Mark and I were just in love with them. And we took the price down and I could not believe the price that we'd taken it down to. And anyway, the strand sold out and it was all brilliant and yeah, awesome. I've got a strand of light amethyst. It's very similar to that. You're gonna love these. <laughs> what do you reckon to those, Linda? They are absolutely beautiful. Aren't they amazing? Wow, there's almost an amethyst going on in there. There is, world. isn't yeah, there? Yeah. Now that is really unusual. There's almost like a citrine and amethyst quality there, known as amethyst. Now. I'm not saying for one second this is amatrine. I'm not saying that at all, because I think that would be wrong of me to say that. But can you see in this amethyst strand, there are moments which are reminiscent of amatrine. There really are. Look at that. Yeah. Beautiful, genuine gemstones. And look at the color. That kind of, oh, I just, I, I love the variety amethyst can give you. In this one strand, you're gonna be getting moments of clarity. You're gonna be getting moments of translucent quality. You're gonna be getting lovely cloudy moments as well, blush moments. Moments where the gem center are almost pink, where they're almost yellow, where they're um, a lot deeper in purple. This is a gorgeous, gorgeous strand. Did you know what the wonderful thing about amethyst is? Everybody has heard of it. Everybody's heard of it. Coral, I'm going to use you as an example. You, do you class yourself as a gemologist? No. She says no. You've heard of amethyst though, haven't you? Yes. Yes, you see? You see? She's heard of amethyst. Doesn't class herself as a gemologist. But she's heard of amethyst. She's heard of, am she's heard of amethyst, bless you. Um, this is one of those incredible gemstones that everybody has heard of in, in lots of different capacities, whether it's whether it's uh, you've worn amethyst before or your mum has or your gran has, or you've seen it on the internet, you've seen it on the, um, you've seen it on the high street. Now, two strands of genuine gemstones here. The code is CRGC40. Do you remember, do you remember how quickly that strand of gorgeous amethyst faceted drops that we bought you last week went? Do you remember how quickly that went? It went very quickly, didn't it? Today, two strands. Light amethyst faceted rice beads and bright white shell pearl 10 mil rounds. This is your deal. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Now you see, I'm looking at these two strands and I'm looking at this amethyst and I'm thinking, right, how many on a strand? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. About thirteen on that strand. You can make thirteen individual rings. You can make thirteen individual pendants. You could just simply wire wrap each one of those pendants, put a, a beautiful shell pearl on the bottom, and you can sell them for a five for each. The whole bundle is less than twelve pounds. Sorry, what was that, darling? Is it really? Well, the drops. Ooh, Laura's giving me a bit of information on that. The light amethyst drops, um, and I think it might be the same strand that we bought you last Tuesday. If it's not, then I do beg your pardon, but I think it might be the uh, same strand we bought you last Tuesday. It's 11.95 on its own. Here, you're getting almost, well, almost exactly the same size as the, as the strand we bought you last week with another strand for the same price. That's incredible, isn't it? So you're gonna be getting shell pearl and genuine amethyst there 
for around about the same price that we bought you that one strand of amethyst for last week. That's incredible, isn't it? Isn't that beautiful? What a whopper cheeker. And do you know what, Linda? That would go so well with your challenge, wouldn't it? Oh, wow, yes, absolutely. Those pearls are amazing. They are, aren't they? They're gorgeous. They're just beautiful. I love the thought of using these together. Now, is this going to go with the barrel that we're going to bring you later on? Yes. Is it going to go with the amethyst we're going to bring you later on? Yes. Is it going to go with the praise light that we're going to bring you later on? Yes. Is it going to go with the heliodor that we're going to bring you later on? Yes. It goes with pretty much everything that we're going to bring you today. Bear that in mind. This is why we bring you price points, which are so low. It's true. It's true. Right. I have got a lovely bunch of coconuts. We've got a lovely, lovely kit for you now. Just realised... Um, and this is probably a bit too much information for everyone. Since last night, since last night, my belly button has now come out. <laughs> it's popped out. I just, I literally, I thought, I thought, oh, what's, what's that? And I just put my hand down and there's like this, boop. Hang on. I'm not oh going to show word. you. It's just come out. It's just literally popped out. <laughs> that must be a jewellery maker. That's first. way too much information for you, yeah. isn't it? <laughs> is it fascinating it's literally just come it's out really fascinating oh that's ever so strange it's Whoa. like the end of the it's like where you tie a balloon isn't it yeah <laughs> <laughs> ah. oh my. Oh. Chloe's bought the camera do you want to get a photo Chloe <laughs> <laughs> no I just thought I'd share that with you <laughs> oh it's all really sensitive as well <laughs> Ooh. Oh. Right, okay. <laughs> uh, right, this kit is called Silver Lining. Silver Lining. Is this the right kit? Just before we start getting excited. This is the right kit, yes? Right, okay, so it's the right kit. Here we go. So, black and white quartz faceted rounds. Beautiful, isn't it? Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. You get black and white qualities here with a gorgeous silvery uh, tone going all the way through here as well. It's just gorgeous, isn't it? Lovely, lovely, lovely. Some of these gemstones are going to be almost entirely black. Some are going to be almost entirely white. Some of them are going to have a lovely mixture. It really is a beautiful strand where you get um, um, a whole different variety of qualities going through it. Next strand, white magnesite six mil plain rounds. Now, you're getting a similar quality in this strand in the fact that it's 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 a strand where each one of these gemstones is unique each one is different but it's much more of a subtle quality so much more of a white background but with a gorgeous kind of black and and, and silvery kind of matrix going all the way through it it's a lovely lovely strand there and then white quartz corner drilled cubes this is beautiful. White quartz corner drilled cubes. The cube shape is a very, very contemporary shape. And, and when it's, and when it's um, corner drilled like these, don't you love it? Because it moves. It's going to give you that gorgeous luster. It's going to give you loads and loads and loads of beautiful um, luster, which is light reflecting off the outside of the genuine gemstones. Next strand, hematite rice beads now this is the new variety of hematite that every single member of our jm team absolutely loves i am in love with this new variety of linda i don't know about you it is it is amazing isn't it's stunning. it it's somehow it's sort of more tactile yeah um and it just well i'll tell you a little story when you come over to me in a minute but it is um very very beautiful yeah it is this is this is silver colored hematite so what you're going to be getting here is what effectively looks like sterling silver beads um, everybody I think wants to be able to wear um, precious metal there are lots and lots of people who um, who only want to use um, sorry who, who only want to wear precious metal and that's absolutely fine when you get a silver coloured gemstone like this, it's like you're getting that precious metal quality, but without the price point that can be attributed with precious metals. You're also going to be getting silver coloured hematite plain rounds. Yum, yum in my tum. Yum, yum in my tum. So, two strands of brand new silver coloured hematite in rice beads and in plain rounds then you're going to be getting your uh, white and black agate faceted rounds then you're going to be getting your white magnesite and your corner drilled 
cubes. Now, that adds up to one, two, three, four, five strands. This is a big kit. Five strands of genuine gemstones. You can add anything you want to this, any colour, any quality to this you want, just purely because you're effectively working with shades rather than colours. So if you wanted to add red or pink or blue or orange or green or purple to this kit, you could do. With this kit, you're going to be getting monofilament, beading thread and elastic. So your essential threading pack. Uh, fantastic for use with smaller gemstones, great for making your stretchy pieces and great for making pretty much everything else. Necklaces, bracelets, earrings, you name it. Now, you're also going to be getting findings and findings are the mechanics which hold your pieces, uh, which hold your pieces of jewellery together. Because I think you're getting such high quality gemstones, because you're going to be getting the silver coloured hematites, I think this has got, the findings in this kit have got to be precious metal, and they are. This is a, a, a 925 sterling silver findings pack. There are 43 findings in total. Now, the findings in this kit range from um, head pins to shepherd's hook earring findings to crimp beads to jump rings to eight inches here we go eight inches of heart link chain i just love this chain i just love it and what linda's done with this is incredible eight inches of 95 sterling silver heart link chain just beautiful as well as all these findings as well if you were to add everything up in this kit together it would come to over 40 Pounds. In fact, it costs almost £43 for everything in this kit. So that's the findings, which are £12.95 on their own. Five strands of gemstones and your threading pack as well. Whenever we put these kits together, whenever we bundle things together, we always, always, always want to give you a saving, to offer you a saving. Today, you are going to be amazed. Five strands of gemstones. Five! And these are gemstones. They're not fake. They're not synthetic five strands of gemstones there they are 43 precious metal findings your threading pack today it's not going to cost you almost 43 pounds today this is your deal 27.95 the most incredible deal for your kit today now are you going to be getting a 30-day money-back guarantee yep are you only paying 2.95 pp per order yep can you make dozens of pieces of jewellery from this kit? Yes, of course you can. And we're going to go and see the pieces of jewellery that Linda's made in just a couple of seconds. But five strands of gemstones, and you can add anything else to this kit that you want. Any colour, any quality. Add the satin cord that we bought you earlier on. Add the deluxe gem selection we've got coming up today. Add any of our brand new strands. Add any of our bundles, the lavender, amethyst, the, uh, the uh, Linda's challenge bundle. This is why this kit is so fantastic, because you're effectively working with shades rather than colours. It's a lovely kit, this one, um, Linda. I really, really like this one. Yeah, it's beautiful, isn't it? It's the sort of luxury version of monochrome, isn't it? Yes, it is. I think the silver hematite in this, the silver coloured hematite, makes a huge difference. It does, it certainly to the does. Kit. It really lifts it up, doesn't it? Mm, yeah, it's beautiful. I mean, the, um, there's a little bracelet there that's all in hematite. Oh, it's um, beautiful. The one there, which is basically sort of a charm bracelet. Well, at Christmas, I wanted to oh, get my daughter so something a bit special because it's the first year with the twins. So um, I had um, a bracelet exactly the same as the one that you are about to see made um, in silver. Right. Um, and then just the, the baby's fingerprints as a oh, little charm, you see. What a lovely but, idea. You know, that cost me three figures, that did. Um, and when I got this kit home and looked at that, do you know, I thought this is equally as beautiful. I think so. For like, well, just probably about three pounds, wouldn't it? If, if that. For a land, as a landmark, I mean, I would love to wear a piece of jewellery like this every day. I just think that, that for me, it's so easy, that looks designer. It? it looks opulent. It looks expensive. And if that was in a, in, in a boutique for sale for £150, I'd buy that. Yeah, as I say, you know, it, it, it really does look the part of, it does. of high end silver. And you know, I mean, I don't know as much about gemstones as you do, but that's not going to tarnish, is it? No, 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 because it's silver coloured. It's silver, yeah. it, 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 it's silver coloured hematite. 
it's not going to tarnish yeah i mean you might find if you wear it every single day then the coating will come off but the gemstone silver underneath as well exactly so actually it's going to add to exactly. the quality it's going to you know you're going to get even more texture from it i love what you've done with this chain Linda. i think that's just such a lovely well, thing to do i mean it's sort of a romantic bracelet because of that heart chain isn't it, is, it? Yeah. so it's nice to make perhaps for for somebody very close to you mm. like you know mum sister daughter mm -hmm. um, but you can add it when you've got you buy kits and you buy gemstone strands um, you can always add odd little bits from you know that you always get little leftovers mm -hmm. and just add them you know in a, very busily down a chain um, and that to me shrieks another charm bracelet but in a slightly different guise absolutely yeah. you know instead of being all the way around the wrist have mm -hmm. a few little chains hanging and, and mm -hmm. pop your mm -hmm. your uh, extra stash little gemstones onto that and it'll look stunning especially mm -hmm. against that silver hematite it really will do it's just such an expensive looking gemstone it's beautiful you've used it beautifully in these rice beads um, with the with the um, corner jewel cubes this is a really lovely piece of jewelry it's a really contemporary looking piece of jewelry I think it's gorgeous isn't it yeah, again, it's very easy to wear, but it's got it's got um, structure, hasn't yes. it? Really, with the square. Absolutely, the yeah. Squares. Gorgeous. These be these earrings are really beautiful as well. You just use different shapes. You just use some of the silver, yes. um, spacer beads, yes. rice beads of the hematite, and of course the rounds as well. They're lovely earrings, Linda. They're so simple and pretty. Yeah, aren't they, they gorgeous? Really are. um, then you've used the hematite with the black and white agate, uh, which is another lovely yeah. design as well. Look how well all those gemstones work together. Do, oh, there's no, magnesite no. in there as well. Yeah, and that magnesite works really, really well, doesn't it? Doesn't it brings it together the agate and the hematite. Yeah. This is such a lovely kit. Um, beautiful little stretchy bracelets here. Oh, you've put another little charm on there. Look at this. That's just that. Uh, those Isn't are that cute? all three of those are stretches. Um, oh. I haven't made stretches for ages, but I just that's again easy to wear, easy to pop on when you're in a rush. In and the easy to make as well. Very Linda. easy to make. These three Very stretchy, but I mean, you could you, you could layer them up, couldn't you? I mean, that yes. one would look lovely with yeah, that sure, one there. Of course you could. It? And again, with the chain on, on, on the bottom one there, just add more gemstones to it. Yeah. I mean, the, uh, the magnesite would look great going along those, but that basically is a, is a, is a structure for a charm bracelet in mm. two different ways, add more beads to them as you get them. And those three bracelets all layered up. I mean, it's all, there's lots of layering about at the minute, isn't there? Is, yeah. And these three bracelets all layered up. I think they look great, don't they? Mm. Aren't they gorgeous? What a lovely, lovely kit really fantastic you've got night and day in here you've got relaxed and sophisticated you've got pretty much everything covered here it's a lovely lovely kit this one and it's a five strand kit yeah you know so you've got lots and lots of gemstones to work with and um, what what um technique would you like to well, show us we'll look at this necklace shall mm. we um because what i like about squares is that they they go together really nicely mm. they're into sort of parallel lines or they'll go into um sort of triangular shapes as well um, so that particular necklace, we start at the centre, so cut enough of the beading thread that will uh, eventually take you round to the clasp, mm -hmm. and then simply thread on four of the cubes, and then it's just a ladder weave, basically, um, a variation on a ladder weave, but we're starting out Pop those down into the centre, mm -hmm. you've got those in the centre of your thread, and then it doesn't matter which end, just return the thread through the exit of the previous one. Okay. And pull them together. Now, as you pull them together, if you guide that one that the double thread's going through, yeah. you'll get a nice oh, sort of diamond that. shape. That's nice. Which is nice as a focal point at the centre. And then simply thread on three. We're keeping this symmetric, this necklace, which mm -hmm. is quite unusual for me. But because we've got soft-sided, what I call soft-sided gemstones, and we've got angular, mm. I just think symmetry might work really well I for agree. that. I agree. Yes, um, absolutely. Particularly if you've got sort of a textured design as well. Mm. And then um, we thread on three of the cubes. And in the very first instance mm -hmm. of threading on the three, sorry I've lost, there it is. I'm using beading thread here, but in the actual example there, okay. I've used the monofilament. It's a personal choice, but the monofilament 
on the necklace there you will find that because we're pulling it into a half diamond shape mm. you'll get a slight amount of the mm -hmm. thread showing I'm doing it with the beading thread here because I personally don't mind that because it's silver and it works well with the kit it but does, if you yeah. don't want to see any then just use the monofilament it's there in the kit mm. so we've popped on three and then what I'm going to do now is to take the surplus thread okay. through the first of those three right okay and push that through let's just get that in right and then before pulling it all the way through we've got mm -hmm. this circle now is pull that up to the hematite rice bead and then pull okay don't worry too much if you get a little bit of extra thread showing. It really doesn't matter because you can move, because you're putting your clasp on last, yes. you can ease your thread round yeah. and push them up. So at this point here, we've got our centerpiece mm -hmm. and then we've got a cube that's sort of within the inside of the neckline because yeah. we've threaded through one. Beautiful. So thread on three more of the hematite rice beads and then followed by three more of your cubes and then this time instead only because it's um, sort of a variation on the pattern mm -hmm. instead of threading through that very first one mm -hmm. we're going to thread through that first one but also the second one oh, okay okay and that should just flip um, the plane of the of the way that the gemstone will sit I'll show you that once we're through yeah, so lovely. again push it through and then hold on to the two that you've pushed through and pull. Mm -hmm. Ease it round. Okay, just ease it round. Actually, the um, the monofilament will slip round a lot more. Yeah, of course it will. You know, I was just thinking that. I mean, you could yeah, do exactly do. the same design with yeah, with, exactly. with monofilament exactly, but for the purpose of the demonstration. Yeah, exactly. So what we'll do when we finish the whole necklace is we sort of that's why before you've put on your class. Mm -hmm. Make sure, because then you finish because you've trimmed off the end, make sure that you've got everything sitting closely. And all you do is simply just push back and mm -hmm. pull, push back and pull. So if you see what I mean now, we're getting, there's our center. Then we've got, because we threaded through on one there, we've mm -hmm. got that one sitting in the neckline mm. inside. And because we threaded through two here, we've got the two sitting on the neckline and mm. the one on the outside. Okay. Okay. So it's thread through one, thread through two until you've done as many as you want. Mm -hmm. And then you work the mirror image up the other side of the necklace. The little pendant at the front where I yeah. put the little hematite is... Um, oh, you've, made your own, you've made your own little links there. Yeah, nice. it's simply the bottom cube I pushed one of the and to be truthful with you the best thing to do is to get one of your cubes first mm -hmm. see whether or not before you actually go on the necklace see whether or not it's going to take two of the head pins and the beading thread as mm -hmm. well because mm. the nature of gemstone is that some are just very, very slightly smaller drilled, yes, some are very, yeah. very slightly larger drilled. But what you've got to do is we've got to thread through um, a head pin that way. And then let's see if we can get this one through okay. this way. But if not, I'll just I love do like using exactly beading through as well for this, for this yeah, demo. Yeah, exactly. Um, and I don't think I can get this one through. Um, but with a monofilament I did. But the yeah. object is, sort them out. I think you will find one if you want to use the beading. And I'm sure you'll mm. find one in the strand that you can get through. But push that one through that way as well. Mm -hmm. And then if I just bring this along yeah, here, sure. is when they're both through at the center there, then just bring them down to this point ah. here, the bo literally the bottom of um, that bottom cube, mm -hmm. and then twist with your round nose pliers, oh, twist um, nice a little loop, yeah. and then add, a, add one of the hematite on afterwards. But it'll, um, it'll work every time with a monofilament, mm, but with a beading yeah, thread, just test it out first. What a gorgeous kit. It's beautiful. I mean, it really is very, very high end. Looking. And you can add so much to this kit as well, can't you, Linda? You can yes. add whatever colours you want. And I think what Linda's demonstrated here is the fact that you've got the kit which has got um, uh, your shades in there. It's a very high end look, especially because of the um, silver coloured hematite. Um, and you can set these gemstones really in any order that you like. You don't necessarily need to be very um, specific about 
about, about each design. You can see in this necklace here, there's every single gemstone from this kit, uh, which has been popped into this necklace here. They all go together. They all work together beautifully. So even if you are a beginner to jewelry maker, this is a perfect kit for you because, because you can make pieces that look as high end as this very, very easily, very, very simply indeed. Gorgeous. Thank you so much for that. Right, let's go see some of your lovely designs on today's Wall of Fame. We're here. I've got number 314. Lovely necklace here made by Linda. Not this Linda. A different there are other Lindas okay. available uh, Linda from Bells Hill who says hi on it Joey maker this is my entry for this week's Wall of Fame it's a necklace made using mm. genuine pearls and peridot it's mm. part of a necklace bracelet and earring mm. set that I've been commissioned to make uh, for a 50th birthday present in August oh you've used peridot because it's next month's birthstone as peridot is a gemstone for August I think it is a <coughs> lovely gift I also use 95 sterling silver findings all from Joey maker and I hope you like it best wishes to Carol as she goes on maternity leave thanks Linda thanks to all the presenters and guest designers and keep up the good work. That's gorgeous. I love birthstone jewellery. That works really, really well. And I'm sure they're going to love it. It's beautiful, isn't it? Yeah, mm. I love it. I love white and that peridot green together. It's beautiful. lovely. Thank you. This is awesome. This is absolutely beautiful. This is right up my street. I've got um, the baby's room at home. It's decorated in that. Is that. it? <coughs> I love it. Absolutely gorgeous. Um, this is from Abby with the most amazing email address. Isn't that fantastic, her email address? Do, do, um, hi all at Joymaker, please find attached my entry for this week's Wall of Fame. Um, seeing as it's such lovely weather, the sun shining, the need for a paddle in the sea, etc. and a summer beach challenge set by a Facebook group I'm in, I thought I'd get my Polly McClay out and Yay! see what the creative juices came up with. Uh, <clears throat> after finding my Polly McClay mojo again, um, and after attending a fabulous course with Debbie Bulford last week, I set to with an idea and a load of clay. This is awesome a quirky beach hut themed necklace all polymer clay and a few seed beads from my stash hope you like it i absolutely love that mm. Abby. i just think that Abby, is so creative isn't it it's just beautiful i love the ice cream on it yeah it's brilliant you've yeah. got bunting on there you've got yeah. a seagull oh it's gorgeous it's fantastic it's mm. beautifully made mm. Beautiful. Well done, Abby. Stunning. And I've got number 315 here. This is another stunning piece here uh, with, um, with daisies on it. Made by Debbie Pepper. Hi to all at Jewelry Maker Towers. Please see attached my latest Wall of Fame entry. Crackle quartz, prenite, pearls and wire, all from your good cells, made into a daisy chain design as requested by a very dear friend of mine to compliment um, a dress of hers. Thanks to all the designers uh, with their hints and tips and masterclasses. Best wishes, Debbie Pepper. Debbie, that is absolutely beautiful. I love that daisy chain look. It looks it looks so, so pretty. And I bet your friend loves that. It's beautiful, isn't mm. it? So fresh and mm. summery and gorgeous. Some beautiful chainmail work here, in pinks and silvers. It's gorgeous. This is 317. Unfortunately, I can't find a name. Mandy. Mandy. Found it. Sorry, Mandy. Um, hi, all at Jewelry Maker Studio. This is made from rose gold uh, plated and silver plated rings. I watched Debbie's DVD and found it very, very good and very easy to follow. I love watching the show every day. And Sunday, I've only been met. Every Saturday and Sunday, sorry. I love watching the show every Saturday and Sunday and I've only been making jewellery since January and I'm addicted. Oh, wow. I hope this is good enough for the Wall of Fame. Thank you. And that's Mandy in Doncaster. Mandy, that's absolutely gorgeous. Mm. Again, it's really summery, isn't it? It's mm. beautiful. It's definitely gorgeous. good enough for the Wall of Fame. It's brilliant. Number 316, someone using malachite here, stardust beads. Wow. Daisy earring findings. Oh, this is lovely. This is from Maureen, uh, who's from Thornaby, who says, Hi, all at Joey Maker. Here's, here's my entry for the Wall of Fame. It's a bracelet and matching earring set uh, made with white Chinese jade, green halite. Oh, I thought it was malachite. Sorry, I beg your pardon. From a six strand bead box I bought a while back, plus findings from my stash. I hope it makes it today um, as it's my birthday today. Oh, happy birthday. Happy birthday. Can you say hello to the fab girls from the Northeast who celebrated with me on Saturday at our fortnight, uh, fortnightly meet? Have a great day. Maureen from Thornaby. Hello, lovely ladies in the Northeast. Hello. And happy birthday to you, Maureen. Fantastic. Right. What have we got coming up? Heliodor. Heliodor coming up in just a few seconds. A really, really beautiful and very rare variety of yellow beryl. It's coming up in a few seconds.
do you need a helping hand to get started with Jewelry Maker? Are you stuck for ideas and need inspiration? Then visit our Jewelry Maker website where you can find our video tutorials. Expand your knowledge and skills with these easy to follow jewelry making demonstrations. Whether you're a beginner, hobbyist or business owner, there's always something new to learn. It couldn't be easier. Simply click and learn some new jewelry making techniques. Want to learn how to make the most of your beading thread? Then come and join in the fun on our Adventures with Beading Thread workshop. Guest designer Gemma Crow will inspire you to design stunning feature pieces of jewellery that will help you to make use of your essential stash items. Full course includes a selection of beading thread, a selection of findings, a bead scoop, use of all relevant tools and equipment, a buffet lunch and refreshments, a tour of the studios and a visit to our Gemstone Museum. All of this for just $64.95. For further information, contact our call centre on 0800 644 655. Tune into Jewelry Maker on Monday the 22nd of July for the art show. We have an abundance of kits and bundles inspired by various art movements from the Impressionist to Pop Art. Make sure you're watching for some great deals, amazing products and special guest, the Mona Linda. Are you new to Jewelry Maker? Would you like to try a new hobby? Then why not give us a call on 0800 644 655 and we'll send you a free copy of our DVD and booklet to help you get started. You don't even need to make an order. Get involved with Jewelry Maker. Tune in to Jewelry Maker on the 23rd of July for Carol's last show. And to celebrate, we're having a Kylie and Jason theme show? Wait, is that right? Uh, yeah, it was Mark's idea. Okay. Anyway, make sure you're watching for a fun packed show with amazing products, lots of fun, and of course, Carol's singing. La 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 la! Oh, wow. This has got to be one of the best examples of Heliodor I've seen on Jewelry Maker. The colour. Oh, the colour is just incredible. This is a strand of gemstones from our um, collector's choice um, variety collection. This offers you the very, very, um, the, the most kind of organic quality of gemstone. Our collector's choice collection um, is very, very much about bringing you those natural varieties of gemstones as close to the host rock, as close to that organic quality as we can possibly get. And the strand of Heliodor you're gonna be getting here is I think a prime example a prime example of that. This comes from the Beryl family, which includes gemstones like aquamarine, emerald, morganite, goshenite. And in fact, there are examples of uh, yellow beryl on our sister channels here at the Genuine Gemstone Company. You can get yellow beryl, yeah, absolutely. What's the difference between yellow beryl and heliodor? Color, color. This, there has to be a certain color attributed with this gemstone for it to be called heliodor. And heliodor, in actual fact, is a reasonably rare Genuine Gemstone. You are getting an entire strand of Heliodor Rough Nuggets. Just to give you an idea how little of this gemstone we actually get at the Genuine Gemstone Company. I think I may have brought you maybe two or three auctions before. 
at the Genuine Gemstone Company for Heliodor, set into Genuine Gemstone Jewellery, and I've bought it to you once on Jewellery Maker. This is how little of this gemstone we actually get on, um, on what, here, here at the Genuine Gemstone Company. For me, it's all about the colour, and that is really what distinguishes this and separates it from Yellow Barrel. Can you see those canary yellows? This is, this is the kind of colour that gem collectors, gem connoisseurs, serious gem collectors I'm talking about. People who really, really love gemstones. People who are really interested in finding out more about gemstones. People who are really interested in where gems are from. This is what they look for when they look for Heliodor. A golden canary yellow tone. It's beautiful, isn't it? I love it. Now, there is another reason why our Collector's Choice collection always, always, always is very, very popular. You know, I think people love that kind of organic quality. I think you love seeing where these gemstones are from. I think you're really interested because you can see how this gemstone is physically formed in the host rock. It's, it's, it's fascinating, isn't it? But there is another reason why this collection is so popular the price points we can do these gemstones at it's the price points we can bring you gemstones like this at this I think is probably only the fourth or fifth time in six years I have bought you Heliodor it is that much of a rarity here at the genuine gemstone company and today this is your price six ninety Five. You are getting a true rarity here, a true rarity, something which is seldom seen on Jewelry Maker. In fact, I think I've only bought it to you four, maybe five times in the last six years. When I think about how many times I've bought you Tanzanite by comparison to how many times I've bought you Heliodor, how many times I've bought you diamonds, not on Jewelry Maker, but on, on our sister channels, by comparison to Heliodor, it really makes me think, goodness me, this is such a special deal. This is such a special opportunity. Now, yes, you are going to be getting colours which are similar to uh, gemstones like Citrine. You are going to be getting colours which are similar to gemstones like Imperial Topaz. Why get Heliodor? Because Heliodor is a gemstone you simply do not see on Jewelry Maker. Heliodor is, in my opinion, that much more of a special quality. And today, it's yours for under seven pounds. When you get this gemstone home, when you start making pieces of jewellery out of this, label it up get a bit of information off the internet, print off little cards about this gemstone because it is a gemstone people will, um, will, will, will not really know about. It's a gemstone which only really gem connoisseurs and gem collectors know about. Get it, add it to your order for less than seven pounds. Absolutely superb, well done. Gorgeous, gorgeous deal there. Now, I've got a finding still for you now. A fantastic finding still for you. Now, we have brought you this bundle before. We have brought you this finding still before. However, however, we've got a few more. Now, let me show you what you're going to be getting here. 925 Stunning Silver Findings. Let me show you what you're getting. You are going to be getting, now is this 100, Lovey? Is this 100, uh, 100? Each one of these 100, lovely. So. 100, is this silver or silver plated copper? Silver plated copper eye pins. These are 30 millimeters in diameter, in, in, in length I should say. These are your eye pins, perfect for making your own gemstone chains. If you literally just get a gemstone, if I just uh, get a gemstone out of the Deluxe Gem Selection and show you what you can use it for. Hang on a minute, if I get one of the large ones from the Deluxe Gem Selection we're gonna do today. There we go. Shove it on there. Here we go. So you literally get your gemstone, you pop it on an eye pin like that. Okay. See that? Yeah. And then you literally make, well, you can cut off a little bit of that um, eye pin there. Don't throw it away for goodness sake. Um, it's silver plate to copper this. And then, and then you can make your own eye on the end of that. And then you have a gemstone with an eye on one end, an eye on another, and it's ready to connect to another gemstone, which has had the same thing done to it as well. So you can make your own gemstone links. This is what things like eye pins are really fantastic for. Fantastic for making your own charms, fantastic for making your own um, uh, tassels and connecting gemstones together. You're getting a hundred of these 
um, silver plated copper eye pins which are 30 um, millimeters in length you're also going to be getting a pack of get these gems back in here otherwise I'm going to get confused a pack of a hundred silver plated copper eye pins which are 40 millimeters in diameter so these are slightly longer and I'll show you next to each other you see they're slightly longer okay and the reason why they're slightly longer is so you can put bigger gemstones on them so you can potentially actually get two eye pins out of one here so if you wanted to put um, a similar gemstone on 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 this eye pin in fact if I go for I'll go for this one here no actually I'll go for I'll go for a larger one if you put one of the larger uh, gemstones on here you can see pop it on again uh, oh, that one's not going on sorry pressure 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 there it is so you pop your gemstone on um, and you'll notice there's a lot more left on the end of this particular eye pin so if there's if there's going to be about a centimeter left which there will be on the end of this one once you've got a gemstone on there and um, cut the end off and you can you can actually make your own eye pin out of this as well so they're much 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 longer these ones so you're going to be getting 40 cent uh, sorry 40 millimeters here 30 millimeters here and then another pack goes on and on and on this does of 100 silver plated copper head pins now these are 40 millimeters in length as well so these are even here we go even more fantastic for making things like your charms you can see it's got a flat top on it so you can um, literally use them for the dangle on earrings you can use them for tassels you can use them in loads and loads and loads of different ways so you're going to be getting a hundred of your 40 millimeter um, uh, silver plated copper head pins 40 millimeter silver plated copper eye pins 30 millimeter silver plated copper eye pins as well and 43 95 stunning silver findings as well this is a picture of everything now the findings at the top of the picture there are all precious metal okay they're all precious metal that's eye pins head pins bolt ring clasps jump rings they are all precious metal findings and there's 42 of them in total the piles of um of eye pins and head pins at the bottom of the screen they're all silver plated copper now that adds up to 300 and 43 findings that's a lot we brought this deal to you last week it went very very quickly there were loads of you on the phone lines we've actually managed to get a little bit more only a little bit more mind you a little bit more stock allocated to this deal so same deal as we bought you last week 343 silver plated copper and 95 sterling silver findings and this is your price 14 pounds and 95p now when you look at a findings pack like this you might be thinking hang on a minute that's a lot of findings there that's more findings than i'm ever going to need that, that i'm ever going to use but in actual fact you will end up using these you will definitely end up using these you will end up using all of these whether it's uh, through necklaces whether it's through bracelets whether it's through um uh, making your own tassels you will end up using them not only that but you very rarely sit down to make one piece of jewelry you sit down to make one piece of jewelry you end up making three pieces of jewelry so having these kind of findings to call and having these kind of findings at hand ready to use whenever you need them that's the important thing don't you think Linda? i mean you will end up using these won't you linda oh, yes of course you will without a shadow of a doubt but the bonus of having a lot more like that is simply the fact that they're there when you get sort of inspiration pop into your head and got to wait yeah. yeah for them to come um but you will go through them yeah. actually you'll go through them quite quickly yeah i mean i i mean i personally find that my most my most useful findings are things like um crimp beads head pins and eye pins those are my three most used findings that i use a lot of i do a lot of charms on stretchy braces like like the one that you saw with them um, um uh, that linda created just a few seconds ago uh, but i do mine with little head pins and just put like a pearl on there or a lovely heart-shaped bead or whatever it is you will get through these findings 343 findings for under 15 pounds it really is incredible well done lots of you on the phone lines there now we've got a course with us today we've got the james business academy with us today <clears throat> now i'll come over and we got our microphone <coughs> oh it's there sorry i didn't even see you there cass you, you, you popped it there when i wasn't looking obviously hello hi are you here for the JM Business Academy course? Yes, we are. Where's Angela? Where is she? She unfortunately can't be with us today. Is she all right? So, uh, she's not very well, I'm afraid. Oh, bless so her. she's at home. So I today I'm teaching for business. <laughs> ah, that's brilliant! Oh, fantastic!
So we've got three lovely ladies with this lady. Whereabouts have you come from? All Sage, Cheshire. Oh, fantastic. What are you looking What are you looking to learn on this course? Well, I would like to set up my own jewellery business. Brilliant. And get out of my pre my job at the moment. There's a lot of people. There's a lot of people who come to jewellery maker and and they start off making pieces for friends and family. Then they realise that it can actually make pieces of jewellery and they realise the joy they get out of jewellery making and you actually start to think, actually, do you know what, I think I'd quite like to do this as a job. So it's a big step, isn't it? But, no. but um, I think you'll learn a lot from this course and, 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 and making your own pieces and being able to sell them on. There's a real sense of satisfaction. Have you, have you sold your pieces of jewellery before? I have done, yeah. It, 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 it gives you a real sense of satisfaction, doesn't it? Yes, it's lovely when people like them and they yeah. want to order something special. And and do you do a lot of commissions? Do people ask you to make pieces I've for them? I've done a few commissions, yeah. Nice. And have they been happy with the pieces? Lovely, especially bridal. <laughs> oh, lovely bridal pieces! There's a lot of pressure when you make bridal pieces, yeah. isn't there? <laughs> but goodness me, you know, making your own pieces, being able to sell them on, it's just, it's just fantastic. Um, and what are you looking to get from the course, my love? I want to create my own business and, uh, you know, move on and create beautiful things yeah you see this is it this is it this is such a fantastic reason to come on the course you will you will learn about um, 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 selling your jewelry in the most unbelievable places it's not just about wedding fairs it's not just about craft stores it's about things like going to um, oh I don't know the baby show or something like that where you wouldn't normally expect to sell your jewelry but if you've got your little store there you're gonna be the only jewelry store there and you're gonna be so different to everyone else selling them in hairdressers and garden centers on your lunch breaks at work and things like that loads of great ideas you're gonna have fun today. You're gonna have it. You're gonna learn loads. Fantastic. <laughs> Thanks, Kirsty. I love it. She, she's a lady with many hats, is our Kirsty. And one of them is a teaching hat. And uh, fantastic. Have fun today. I love the way you're in height order as well. Was that on purpose? Was that on purpose? <laughs> There's Kirsty. And no, she isn't sitting down. She is actually standing up. <laughs> Thanks for joining us, ladies. I'll come and see you after the show today. Thank you. Oh, tell you what, I may not be a lady, but I'm a woman. <laughs> nah. Carry on, that was good. Really good. You don't know the words, do you? Da 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 song where's your mama gone where's your mama gone where we're gonna miss you you so are gonna miss much. me you better miss me we are carol what are you gonna miss about me linda you're singing <laughs> really i think so yeah <laughs> whoever's whoever's sitting there after you <clears throat> huh Whoever's sitting there after you is obviously going to have to learn to sing. They're going to have to learn to sing yeah. to my level as well. Yeah, exactly. I'm a natural singer, Linda, so things I like that can't this. be taught. I do know this. <laughs> Here we go. You could never be taught to sing like you, Carl. No. 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 Right. What are we doing now? Storage bag! Right. This is... Uh, forgive me. I'm going to get very excited about this. I feel very lucky to be able to bring this to you today. I have not seen this for ages on Jewelry Maker. Ages and ages and ages. Do you remember when we first got these storage bags in stock, Linda? I absolutely do, and I still got mine. I still use it every day. Every day. Honestly, every truly, single every single, day. single solitary day, yes. This is one of those things that you're a jewellery maker, you've got to have a storage bag. Let's 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 show you what this is all about and, and why we get so excited about this. Okay, so you've got your storage bag here, which is in a lovely canvassy heavy duty fabric, okay? Jewelrymaker.com branded, of course. It comes with a little handle like that, and it comes with a strap which you can make a little bit longer, a little bit shorter as well. So, fantastic. So that is how you carry it, basically. You've also got zip, zip, <gasps> zip, do, do, do. and another zip, and Velcro. And you undo your storage bag. The front comes down, and inside here you get one, two, three, four, five storage boxes. 
I'll move these to one side and let me show you one of these storage boxes. Ah, oh, there we go. There's one that's been a wrap. That's great. These storage boxes are awesome. They're wonderful. They are um, the right things if you want to put polymer clay in them, if you want to store gemstones in them, if you want to store findings in them. They're basically three compartments, three compartments um, storage boxes, okay? And you get three compartments, but you also get all of these as well, which are little dividers. And you can use these dividers to, if I just show you one of them in action, give it a bit of a twist, get it out, there we go. Ah, there we go. And you can get your divider, pop it in, and you can set, you can put your findings in there, you can put, um, uh, I don't know, uh, crimp beads in one, gemstones in another. Uh, you can put loads and loads and loads of different findings in here. Now you can get loads and loads and loads of different dividers in here. They can be different sizes, of course, uh, to accommodate different things. Um, I have seen lots and lots and lots of jewelry makers who have got dozens of these storage bags and boxes. And what they do is they fill uh, one of them with red gemstones, one with blue gemstones, one with green gemstones, one with yellow gemstones. Because they're see-through, and I know this is an obvious thing to say, but because they're see-through, you can see what's inside them. So you don't have to, you don't have to um, keep on opening your boxes to find those findings or to find that particular gemstone. Um, you don't have to use them for jewellery making. You can use them across every single bit of crafting uh, that you can think of. Whether you're a seamstress and you want to put different threads in there, you want to put needles in one, you want to put um, um, uh, bits of cord, you want to put um, you want to put your ribbons in there, your bits of lace. If you're into DIY, or if or, or if or, or if someone you know is into DIY, put nails in them, put screws in them, put uh, raw plugs in them. You can do whatever you want. I think it's. Um, one of our presenters, her dad uses them for um, fishing tackle. He's, he's, he's got one just full of fishing tackle and flies and things like that. Um, you, can, you can use it for whatever you want. The main thing here is the fact that it's organized, the fact that it's um, nice and tidy and organized and you've got things on to hand. When you, when you are making anything when you're baking a cake when you're making a card when you're doing anything crafty or when you're doing anything creative you want all of those bits and pieces to hand don't you you want all those bits and pieces to hand this is going to keep all those bits and pieces to hand you can take out a couple of these uh, boxes put your small toolkit in here zip it up you're ready to go to your craft fair you can put all your made up pieces of jewelry in here ready to put on your craft stall as well you can cover them in fabric and use them as layers when you take them to craft fairs there are so many ways in which you can use these now we're going to have to get the price out for you i've got lots of you on the phone lines lots of you on the web as well here's your deal today for this storage bag with five storage boxes 12 pounds 95p now in my honest opinion in my honest opinion um I would probably come in and get two of these, maybe even three of these. And you might be thinking, yeah, but that's going to make my parcel even bigger and I'm going to be paying more PNP. Do you know what? You're not. You're not paying any more in PNP. You're still paying 2.95 PNP per order. You can use this in so many different ways. You will find them so useful. And um, I wish that when I did my craft fair in uh, December, I wish that I'd had one of these. They were out of stock, unfortunately. They were out of stock for months on Jewelry Maker. Um, and I had to um, use lots and lots and lots of cardboard boxes. I had pieces of jewelry that were falling out of the boxes, going to the bottom of the boxes. Um, and I wish that I'd have had these because at least it would have um, allowed me to keep all my jewelry really nice and organized and really nice and, um, and, and tidy and looking professional as well. Um, Linda, like I've said, you can use this with lots in, in, in lots of different ways, um, not just with jewelry making, but in crafting as well. Um, and I think the quality of this is, is pretty fantastic as well, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, well, exactly. I use mine every day, as I said before, and I've still got my original one. Um, <coughs> Sheila has got two because she sort of bits and bobs between her house and, and, and Sarah's house, yeah. so she keeps one there. Um, Jessie's got one as well because she um, does jewellery mm. with Sheila. Um, and they're great for, I mean, I've got to go on a four hour train journey in a couple of weeks and that will be what I'm taking. Of course, yeah. With me. And then, you know, it's all there. It's all compact. If you label them off as well, say, you know, head pins and eye pins in the one and this, that and the other, you know exactly what you're going, um, what you're looking for and you know exactly where it's going to be. Mm. Um, my brother was, apps, the first Christmas that those came out, I got my brother one. He's the most avid fisherman that you will ever, ever meet. Mm. And he's still using his. And I mean, that's been in all sorts of weather conditions. Yeah. 
And not only that, because it's because it's black as well, and it's and it's and it's fairly plain other than the yeah, branding, you can definitely. accessorize it yourself. Do whatever you want with it. It's a great way of starting off somebody's hobby for them. It's only twelve ninety five. You may as well start off somebody's hobby with a bang, you know. And even if you want to, which I know a lot of people do, is um, they fill these full of gemstones, they fill them full of pieces of jewelry, and then give them away as gifts. You know, give them away as an eighteenth or a twenty first uh, birthday present. You fill them full of bits and pieces and give them away as gifts. I think it's a great idea as well. Fantastic. So twelve ninety five. What an awesome deal! Right now, thanks, Cass. Like I said, just before we came on air today, um, I had an apology to make, and my apology was, I'm so sorry I didn't update my Facebook page and the Jewelry Maker Facebook page this morning with what we had on the show, but there was a very, very, very good reason for it. And the very good reason for it was the Jaluxe Gem Selection. Um, I saw this Jaluxe Gem Selection this morning and this is, a, this is a kind of deluxe gem selection that I've been waiting for on Jewelry Maker. This is a perfect example uh, to find something like this on Jewelry Maker. Um, this is the kind of branding that you get with this. I just love, love, love the branding here. It's wonderful, isn't it? Jewelry Maker, deluxe gem selection. Now, inside is a tube full of genuine gemstones, full of genuine gemstones. What I love so much about this particular gem selection is the variety. Now we've bought you loads of gem, uh, uh, deluxe gem selections over the last few weeks and maybe they've been, oh I don't know, labradorite and moonstone ones or they've been uh, rose quartz and amethyst ones. You've been able to get maybe two, maybe three different gemstones in a deluxe gem selection. This is one of the first times that I've been able to bring you a deluxe gem selection with this amount of variety. Now, should we see what kind of gems you're going to be getting in here? Let's have a look, shall we? At the minute, I can see, and look at the different sizes and shapes you're getting as well. Labradorite. Uh, rose quartz. Carnelian. Citrine, fluorite, oops, peridot, moonstone, lemon quartz, appetite. I mean, you are literally getting the biggest selection of gemstones I've ever seen in a deluxe gem selection. The main attraction for the gem selections, I think, um, of having spoken to guest designers who've come in to get these, having spoken to guest designers who've had these as challenges, it is the variety that you get. This is like getting, um, this is like getting the who's who of gemstones and like a taster of all these different gemstones, all these different shapes and sizes in one deal. To get, to get, the amount of variety you are getting in this deluxe gem selection, you would probably have to buy 20 different strands maybe. Because yes, you've got Labradorite, but you've got Labradorite squares. You've got Labradorite coins. <laughs> you've got Labradorite drops. Yes, you've got Appetite, but you've got Appetite ovals. You've got Appetite uh, Drops. You've got Appetite Nuggets. You know, you are getting tons and tons and tons of different examples of that one gemstone. So you would probably have to buy about 20 gemstone strands in here. And then I thought, okay, I wanna see how long the strand of gemstones is that you can actually get from this deluxe gem selection. If I was to put all of these on monofilament, so at about eight o'clock, I started to put all these gemstones on a piece of monofilament. And they all fell off. Because <laughs> I didn't tie a knot on the end of it. So I didn't, I did I I said, oh, I said, oh bother. That's annoying. 
Oh dear me, that is such a shame. Or words to that effect. I just want to show you. <laughs> I just want to show you the length that I managed to get out of this Gelux gem selection in a short amount of time, out of just a few gemstones. Now look at this Gelux gem selection. I've just dropped some on the floor, but anyway. This top bit here, and I'll show you actually, this top bit here, which is literally less, what, what is it, a centimetre and a half worth of gemstones? That much of the bead scoop, which is only a tiny fraction. It's nowhere near a quarter, it's nowhere near a half. This is the length of gemstones I put on monofilament out of that amount of gemstones. That's enough for a bracelet. If you had double the amount, almost enough for a necklace. So this, this length of gemstones here, which is, oh, it must be about what? Six inches? Six, in six inches worth of gemstones there, and definitely enough for a bracelet. And I only used that much of the Deluxe Gem Selection. It just shows you how much you can get from this. We've had Wall of Fame entries over the last few weeks where people have been sending in photos of a necklace, bracelet, and earring set and, being, and, 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 and saying, I've got enough left now for a bracelet or for maybe even another necklace. And, 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 um, and I can't believe I've managed to make so much out of this Deluxe Gem Selection. We're having loads of Wall of Fame entries. I've seen Facebook entries as well from, ex uh, from people saying exactly the same thing. In all honesty, I think you probably have to get about 20 strands. If you wanted to get the variety, the variety you are getting in this Deluxe Gem Selection. Now, price point wise, price point wise, there's a lot of variety here. Like I said, if you were to get maybe 20 strands of gemstones, you might just about have the variety that there is in this one Gelux gem selection. 20 strands of gemstones, that sounds like it might be pricey. That sounds like, you know, even if it was a five or a strand, that's a hundred pounds. That's a hundred pounds worth of gemstones there, isn't it? That's a lot of money. Or you can come in and get this gem selection today. And the, pro, uh, uh, and the incredible deal we're going to offer you today for this deluxe gem selection, it is under a tenner. In fact, it's this price here, $8.95. $8.95 for this amount of variety, this amount of quality, this amount of gemstones. You're getting appetite, you're getting labradorite, you're getting... Um, 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 rose quartz you're getting carnelian you're getting peridot you're getting fluorite you're getting white quartz you're getting citrine but with all of those gemstones you're not just going to be getting one shape of them you're getting drops you're getting nuggets you're getting rounds you're getting cubes you're getting bicones you're getting wheels um i think this is the best bead scoop we've ever done uh linda yeah, i really I honestly that, do didn't i when i came in this mm. morning i saw it i said it's the it's the nicest one i've seen yeah um what I think is really useful, um, because you've got so many of them as well, is if you do thread like six or seven inches of them onto a, onto a strand, and if you if you sell your jewellery mm. at craft fairs or wherever, and just have that showing, and then I mean there's birthstones in there, there's all sorts, and yeah, if, if anybody's got a personal choice on, if you if you say get known for making charm bracelets. Mm. then a uh, charm bracelet is made up very, very quickly and you can get people to choose which gemstones they want on them. Of course, yeah. Um, and that, as you just said, is by far and away the cheapest way of, of buying for that sort of category of jewellery making. Exactly. <laughs> and being able to make those charm bracelets though, Linda, and making those charm rings, quite often people up until now have had to buy exactly. a dozen strands of gemstones. Exactly. Uh, they've had to make, um, you know, they've had to buy a dozen strands. They've had to buy loads and loads and loads of strands of different gemstones and save them up and save their money up to buy those gemstone strands. Now you can get them in one deal. You can get them in one go. You can get all of them in one hit. It's $8.95. And in my personal opinion, you know, multi-buy this, multi-buy this, get as many of these as you possibly can, because having gemstones like this to call on, you've got an entire stash of gemstones there for 8.95. 
you know, oh goodness me, charm bracelets, charm rings, you know, those beautiful bubble rings and bubble, br and, and, and bubble uh, bracelets. They look wonderful. There's a lot of work that goes into them, hundreds of gemstones, and quite often people have to buy a dozen strands or 20 strands of gemstones to be able to make those designs. Here, you don't have to do that. One hit, one price, $8.95, that's all it's gonna cost. And you can make those incredible pieces. I just think it's amazing, just incredible. And there's the equivalent of meters of genuine gemstones here, meters. Amazing, well done, hold those lines, great deal there. Lots of you on the phone lines there. There is a bit of a queue, just hold the lines. We will answer your call, we know you're waiting. Right, next deal. This is called Silver Mirror. Oh, is it? Oh, I beg your pardon, it's not called, it's not called Silver Mirror. The findings deal was find was um, silver mirror whatever it was called. Right. We just had the um, the Jane Business Academy in, and one of those uh, was uh, talking about being able to make pieces uh, for weddings, making pieces to order, making pieces as commissions. Um, Linda, why do you think people? Hmm. Why do you think maybe a potential bride would ask somebody to make them a a headband or a tiara why wouldn't they go to a shop and buy it there's two reasons in my book the first reason is I mean I've done it myself with my daughter's wedding three years ago when you go to the shop um, you will find in the main you'll find like a section that are all exactly the same or a slight variation mm. on a theme and they're going to be expensive because you put that magic word wedding in front of anything and there's no mm. doubt about it it exactly. just it multiplies um, but if a bride asks you, it's because she has got an idea in her head. She wants to theme it up with, with I mean, a wedding is normally a mm. theme, isn't it? So she can work with the bridal party and have sort of variations on it. But she wants something specific, Yeah. which you just can't go at. You know you can't get specifics in shops. Yeah, yeah. I think, I think if you, you're right, Linda, people, um, uh, weddings, proms, 21st birthday parties, 50th birthday parties, people have an idea in their head about how they want to look. And it's probably something that they've thought about for a long, long time, especially with weddings and uh, proms. It's something which you've been planning in your mind since you were a little girl. Oh, I really want to look like this, and I really want a hair slide that looks like that, and I want a tiara that looks like that. People, um, uh, ladies and, and, and gents, have, you know, have an idea in their head about how they want to look. Now, um, this is where you step in. And you can sit down with your with your client, and you can talk about designs, and you can talk about colours, and you can talk about you know um, uh, mood boards, and you know how they you know the kind of colours and any kind of um, uh, snippets from magazines that they've been inspired by. Uh, they might want to show you a picture of their dress. They might want to um, show you pictures of their family as well, and say, look, this is what my mum's going to be wearing, and I want this to tie in. Um, you're making someone special day for them. That is why I think people come to you. They have an idea in their head, as Linda says, and obviously when you go to bridal shops, goodness me, put wedding in front of anything, wedding, wedding headdress rather than just a headdress, and you can pretty much double the price, can't you? Um, being able to have accessories and tools like this to call on is an essential. These hair slides here, you're going to be getting five in silver and five in gold. These have been out of stock for months. I haven't seen these for months on Jewelry Maker. Haven't seen them, just haven't seen them. And that's not for uh, us not ordering them, that's just literally the demand is so high at the minute, it's purely because of the wedding season. You know, the wedding season tends to be um, spring and summer. Get these stock up now for next year, stock up now for autumn and winter weddings because these have been out of stock for ages, for months. We do one, uh, run uh, wedding workshops here at Jewelry Maker, uh, which are run by the lovely Sheila Davies. Uh, if, you do, if you do want to book onto our uh, wedding workshops, then please, please uh, do. Speak to the Call Central Live Help and we'll get you booked onto our bridal workshops. Five of the, uh, of, of the uh, kind of yellow gold colored hair slides and five of the silver colored hair slides, okay? As well as your 10 hair slides, you're also gonna be getting five yellow gold colored tiara band blanks again these have been out of stock for months it's great for flower girls great for tiaras great for brides and five of your silver colored hair bands um tiara blanks as well 
Now, Linda was saying a little bit earlier on that she's, she has seen the hair slides for sale elsewhere. You will be able to get these hair slides and these tiara bands um, uh, for sale. Um, you will be able to find them in other shops. You'll be able to find them on the internet as well. But similarly, because people know that people are gonna be making pieces for weddings and they're very, very popular, um, people can get away with charging an absolute fortune for things like these. They really, really can do. Just, just for the blanks, without any gemstones at all on them. Here at Jewelry Maker, because we want you to come in and get these and make t uh, tiaras and hair bands out of these and hair slides out of these, and we want you to get the gemstones from us as well, and we want you to get the wire from us as well, which you would attach them all um, onto the blanks with, then we keep that price as low as we can. Honestly, this is one of those deals that I am so confident that we cannot be beaten price-wise here. I am absolutely convinced that if you go anywhere else, whether it's a craft shop, whether it's the internet, with any kind of shop, for this quality and for this quantity, I honestly think we won't be able to be beaten. This is your deal for 10 tiara blanks and 10 hair slides. Bonkers, that's what it is. That is absolutely bonkers. Now you can come in and get any of our gemstones today come in and get our deluxe gem selection for 8.95 come in and get our multicolor beryl come in and get our beautiful praise light our eye light come in and get any of our kits today make tiaras make hair slides make beautiful pieces for uh, for people to wear that's going to make their day send it on to them it's not going to cost the earth to come in and get all these incredible materials you can just keep on adding to your order, Linda. It's amazing, isn't it? That, That's that, stunning. That price. Absolutely stunning value. I mean, seriously so. But I must add also, and you must believe me, that the quality is second to yeah. none. Mm. The combs are all uniform. They're not all bent out of shape. They're absolutely brilliant. And what I like about the tiara bands is that wider, flatter surface that you've got to wire onto. Yeah, definitely. Because a lot of them are quite flimsy and, and very, very thin. But this has got just just such a great medium to work onto. Yeah, yeah. It's strong. It's very, very structured. You, I mean, you can make your own tiara, um, uh, tiara bands out of some of the thicker gauge wires that we do. But as Linda quite rightly says, um, to, to be able to wire onto tiara bands which are this thick and this rigid is just wonderful. The quality is just superb just gorgeous not only that but here's one of our um, hair slides in action as well uh, which has been uh, wired onto and in fact we're going to see a little bit later on in the show um the pieces that linda has created from her challenge as well with the hair slides it really is lovely 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 to be able to bring you such a fantastic such a fantastic quality at such a low price um and I really do not think that we can be beaten. I honestly, I honestly, honestly, honestly think that for quality, we just we just can't be beaten. I honestly think that. Now, um, Laura actually, in the last few seconds, has actually uh, been on the internet and has actually been looking for tiara, uh, uh, um, tiara hair bands and hair slides. Tiara bands on their own each, she's managed to find a deal for how much, sorry? About, about three pounds 50 for one tiara blank for one tiara blank, there you go. I don't know what the quality is like. It might be, it might be um, just as good. It might be, it, 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 it might not be as good. Here you're getting 10 tiara blanks and 10 hair slides for 7.95. Do your research, use your 30 day money back guarantee. These are designed to last, they're designed to have quality. It is in our interest to bring you these with quality um, and with longevity in mind because then you will come back to jewelry maker time and time and time and time and time again. We don't, we don't, we don't have, we don't really have a lot of customers who maybe make one order from us and then never come back to Jewelry Maker again. The majority of times we have um, uh, customers who are with us for years and years and years, and that is because of what you get and what you are actually paying for. You get quality and you get um, fantastic low prices. It really is the most amazing deal we're offering you today for $7.95. Just love it. And stock up, great uh, great opportunity to stock up. Because if you have somebody who comes to you and says, help, I've got a prom to go to, um, it's this Saturday, I haven't got a tiara to wear, I need you to make me one ever so quickly. You want all of these things to hand. Carol also, um, sorry to interrupt you, but also- No, not at all. It's really, um, I don't think it would be easy to find a, a bundle buy, a package buy with both colored metals. You get ah, one that's or the other in a pack. But yeah. You've got, again, you've got that bridal party prom lady, whatever. You've got 
the choice of the two there, which they're either going to go for silver or gold, yeah. and you've got them both, and you've got them in, in, in a package. Yeah, being able to offer your customer yeah. the choice as well is a really, really powerful thing as well, saying, oh yeah, well I have got silver coloured, but I've also got gold coloured. And, it, and if they don't want either, then you can cover it in fabric. You know, you can do whatever exactly. you want with it. You can swell against it if you want to. Do whatever you want with it. Seven ninety five though for twenty accessories. It's amazing. Just incredible. Well done. What a treat. Now, Laura, can I just clarify something? Three kits today, yeah. Three kits. We've done one, haven't we? How much was the how much was the first kit? Twenty seven. Twenty seven ninety five. Okay. Okay. And and you did say that there was that there was were there two kits going under twenty today? Right. Oh, is this a kit? You are about to see. An amazing kit. I cannot, I can't believe what we're actually going to do with this. I'll believe it when I see it. I'll believe it when I see it. That's all I'm going to say. Golden coloured shell pearl rounds. Beautiful stunning it's like an imperial gold isn't it it's beautiful it's like a sunflower gold lovely lovely shell pearl plain rounds these are six millimeters in diameter white moonstone irregular squares <laughs> look at these can you see that silvery shiller coming off this strand? This white silvery shiller coming off this strand. That is natural. That is moonstone. That is shiller, which is an optical property from moonstone. It's just beautiful, isn't it? Is this kit really going under 20 pounds? Okay, okay, okay. Here's your threading pack, monofilament, beading thread, and elastic. Okay. Well, it looks great. Monofilament, beading thread, and elastic. You're also going to be getting with this kit 10 meters of 0.6 millimeter gauge gold plated copper wire. 10 meters. 0.6 millimeter gauge, I beg your pardon, gold colored copper wire. Now, you can make your own findings with this. You can uh, make your own jump rings with this. You can do whatever you want with this wire. It's 0.6, it's probably the most versatile gauge of wire we have in stock. 10 meters there. You want to see the findings? 98 yellow gold plated copper findings, 98 of them. That includes a meter of chain, eye pins, head pins, bolt ring clasps, jump rings, ribbon endings with extender chains, toggle clasp there, senorita clasp, uh, uh, rondelles, you're going to be getting uh, earring findings as well. There are dozens of different types of findings in this gorgeous kit. Yeah? Okay. I've got another strand of gemstones here in this kit. And I honestly, I'm looking at this strand of gemstones and I'm thinking, right, okay, hang on. I know, and we all know now, this kit is going to go under 20 pounds. When I show you the next strand of gemstones, you will be asking yourself the same question I asked myself just a couple of seconds ago. How? How? Why, oh my goodness, gems of distinction, labradorite, plain drops, 
we are going to have to get a price out this kit is going so quickly labradorite shell pearl moonstone wire findings a threading pack i'll tell you what i believe it when i see it apparently this kit's going under 20 pounds oh oh my goodness me this is just incredible this labrador it is some of the best labradorite i have ever seen in my life look at that look at that oh my look at the size of that one the largest one here is 22 by 14 millimeters it is gigantic look at the quality the the oh my goodness me the labrador it is amazing this strand of gemstones on its own i would i would put a price on it of 27.95 or 29.95 or 31.95 not to mention which you're getting another two strands of gemstones your threading pack your 98 findings your 10 meters of wire all for under 20. right we've got to go and see this jewel that linda's makers i i honestly i just cannot believe that we have done that price point for this kid do you know what linda i love jewelry maker i'm always up for amazing prices on jewelry maker i always expect great prices on jewelry maker but this is ridiculous it's ridiculous it's ridiculous gosh it is ridiculous what was this kit like to work with oh, did you amazing. have any idea it was going to go this low oh gosh no oh no 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 i thought this was going to be the 27.95 one minimum well minimum yeah. i'd say 32.95 yeah. 34.95 for this kit i mean the um the labradorite is just so so beautiful and so sizable i mean you've got you've got at least on this strand that I worked with, I have got one, two, mm. three, four, five, six, seven standalone pendants in the lab. And with the gold pearls, wow, does it bring out that golden shiller, doesn't it? It really does. Linda, the jewel you've made is so beautiful. Really, it looks really so high it. end. Yeah. It looks like a boutique collection, don't you think? It, does. it simply does, absolutely, most definitely. It's beautiful. I just, I just, um, let's talk about, I mean, this Labradorite here, the Labradorite earrings that you've made here, you've simply used two crimp beads, yeah. a pair of earring findings, two Labradorites, some beading thread. I would sell those earrings on a craft stall, 25 pounds. Yes. At uh, least. Definitely. Um, it's, again, it's quality, isn't it? Just look <gasps> it, at it. It's supreme quality. Some of the best quality Labradorite I've ever seen in my life. And the cut as well, this nice smooth teardrop cut is mm. so, so pretty. You've used the Labradorite beautifully in here. And as you say, with the golden, the golden coloured pearls. shell pearl. Yeah. <gasps> yeah, oh yeah. my I goodness me. And look at the wire detail there as well. Just look at the shiller on that cow. Oh, it's just, it, it's the most incredible Labradorite, isn't it? It's just yeah. unbelievable. Beautiful, Gorgeous. stunning charm bracelet here. I mean, that looks like it could, it could have cost 100, 120 pounds. It's so beautiful. The pearls are just lovely. Oh, they're they? wonderful, they are aren't they? So golden. Gorgeous, gorgeous pieces here. Beautiful necklace where you've made your own links with the wire twister. Moonstone and shell pearl earrings moonstone and shell pearl necklace this is just opulence it's serious opulence now what technique are we going to see linda because this kit's going to sell out within the next few seconds what what technique are we going nice to see flower here oh, um, that would just be amazing yeah. to see that um but because this is a high-end gemstone the labradorite mm. okay um the the guys that cut them are, are very very careful um mm. particularly when they're cutting at a point aren't they Absolutely, they're very yes. careful um so consequently i didn't want to use the wire going through that very tip because oh, wow. you know i didn't want to damage um the gemstone in any way so i thought well let's work around that i still want to use the wire because i thought how beautifully it went with the lab mm. um so all that you need to do to create that flower and the necklace if you want to do the the neck piece too mm. is to cut a piece of beading thread that's the length the finished length of the necklace that you want and add about another probably another 12 inches because it just it just gives you if you change your mind halfway through that you can make it longer um, and thread on 
Sorry, I'm trying all this jewellery on. Sorry. <laughs> Thread on five of um, the Labradite drops. Mm. Now, I've gone for five of the larger ones because it's a very dramatic central mm. point. So just literally thread them on and let them drop to the centre of that uh, beading thread. Okay. And then simply tie an overhand knot. Okay. okay. That's so nice very, and easy. very simple. Yeah. Tie your overhand knot and you'll see that then you'll gather them all up into this little flower shape. So tie it into an overhand knot. Um, Go over again and then um, perhaps stabilise that knot. I haven't really drawn it up close enough, but no, I have actually, that's fine. Um, stabilise that knot there with um, some glue or some clear nail varnish. Now hang on to, don't be tempted to, to take off this excess beading thread because this is what we're going to use up the neckline. Lovely. Okay, then um, take a working length of your wire. Just so you know, this kit has all been allocated at the minute, but we're going to bring you the details back for the hair combs and tiaras deal because I think this would work beautifully with, with this kit, wouldn't it? Making your oh, own yeah. tiaras and hair without slides a doubt. out of this. Without a doubt. Yeah, because you've got the wire as well, which is lovely. Definitely. And then all you need to do is to pop the wire through the centre hole of, um, of the flower mm. and then take the wire behind the first one, over the next one, behind the next one, and continue working that around get your excess down at the back so if you continue working that around you will find that you will get see it's coming over all of them now so back behind back again in front oh, that's nice and, and continue simple. working that um, the wire is is very easy to manage mm. okay so when you're getting onto your second row just tighten that up just a little bit okay bring it round over the top again. Work it round really um, as many times as, as you want to. Um, each time it's coming round, you see now it's no longer floppy. Yeah, it's all. nice and rigid. Yeah, so just keep it coming round and then when you have done as many as, as you want, and believe me, you can get carried away with this I technique. bet you can. You really can because um, it just gets such a nice pattern. Mm. And do you know what would be quite nice would be just to do one petal completely in the wire lines and just leave the other four as they are. Oh yeah, that that's really, a nice really idea. Nice. And then simply, when you've finished, you've got as many as you want, okay, we'll just go on to that other one to make it even, um, is bring it up the back of a petal and then pop on one of the gold beads, one of the gold shell pearls mm. and bring it across. Centre it okay just literally center it with your thumb and then what i did i worked another row mm. to stabilize okay. that okay then you can trim off your excess what i do is i tend to just get the two strands of wire and then give it a little twist yeah twist the pendant mm. trim off your wire and then obviously use your flat nose pliers then to push those wire endings down so that they're not sticking out you can okay. you know, the flatness pliers work great for that and then you've got your beading thread from the original um tying of the pendant to work up along the neckline is that beautiful and 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 to put it with the hairband and tiara deal that we just bought you for 7.95 that could go on a hair slide that could go absolutely. on a tiara absolutely that could be a centerpiece to a bracelet absolutely absolutely the moonstone's divine i mean, i love that necklace yeah, at the so end there um, it's just mm. such an easy neck to wear, but it's so striking. Yeah, it's so, so, so striking. This kit is absolutely out of this world, isn't it? It's under £20, and our next kit's going under £20 as well, which is going to be amazing. Beautiful technique, amazing gemstones. Um, I want all this jewellery. I want it all. It all looks so wonderful, so expensive, and I'm definitely having those earrings. Right, don't go anywhere. Uh, we're going to see you over the Wall of Fame in just a couple of seconds. See you over there in a couple of secs. This is absolutely gorgeous and lovely hammered um, wire work going on here. Mm. This is 319 and it's from Amanda in Nottingham. Hi all, jewellery maker. My entry to this week's Wall of Fame is a necklace full of firsts. First time I've ever used the gizmo to make a coil to encase the memory wire around the neck. Oh. 
It's also the first time I've ever used my hammer and block. Oh. All the metal shards are 1.5 mil wire. Oh, I was lovely. inspired by a piece Gemma made a few weeks ago and I'm really pleased with how it turned out. And I also made my first ever jump rings as well. Yay. Everything used, all tools and materials and from JM. Fingers crossed for a win. And that's from Amanda. Amanda, do you know what? If that was in a competition, you'd get first. Yeah, definitely. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. It's stunning. It's so dramatic. I love it. Mixing yeah. up those precious metal colours as well. It's love lovely, it. isn't yeah, it? Love it? We're going to be drawing the Wall of Fame today, don't we forget. Are, yeah. Number 322. Lovely. Very simple three strand weave here. Lovely colours, though. Really lovely colours from Emma in Derby. Hi, jewelry maker. Latest entry for the Wall of Fame. How light and sewed like necklace. I uh, did a craft for at the weekend, but unlike Mark, it was um, it was dire and hardly sold anything. Oh, oh Emma, I'm sorry. Uh, I was lucky. Show. Lots of the crafters uh, didn't sell at all. Oh, maybe it was just quiet then. Uh, need to win. Uh, to feed my bead addiction love the shows presenters and guest designers regards emma emma don't give up hope no don't don't give up hope keep going to those craft fairs emma especially if you do what looks like that it's gorgeous this is gorgeous isn't it this another is this, daisy yes, inspired yes. piece this is number 320 from i hope i'm spelling this right uh, saying this right naringa or naringa from high wickham in Buckinghamshire. Mm -hmm. um, hi everybody at Drawing Maker Towers. Finally I was persu persuaded by guest designer Mark on Saturday to send my entry to the Wall of Fame. I'm making jewellery um, only for two and a half months and this is my first entry to the Wall of Fame. I was so inspired by the design I made my first macrame earrings by using multicoloured crackle quartz and silver threading. All bought from Jewellery Maker. Hope you like it. Naringa I think it's absolutely Beautiful. Yeah, that's stunning. Thank you so much for that. That's beautiful. So unusual. Mm, that's gorgeous. Cool. Uh, I've got number two, uh, 323 here. This is a lovely photo, lovely background to it as well. Look at that. Oh, that is um, divine. From Tracy in Sheffield, Look who says, it. Hi, all at Jewelry Maker Towers. I hope you've all enjoyed this lovely sunny weather. We have. Just sat and watched Carol and Mark's show with my 17 month old grandson, Oliver. Every time he saw Carol, he pointed at her and sang. Oh, was lovely. That's <laughs> nice. So cute. He loves carol singing. Um, he'll, he will love the Kylie and Jason show and he's going to miss her when she goes to leave to have gherkin. Um, hurry back. My wall of fame is a necklace made from uh, Prainite nuggets with gold spacer beads and gold findings all from JM. Uh, looks beautiful, warm with a maxi dress. Looking forward to many more beautiful and excellent quality gemstones at exceptional prices. Keep up the excellent work and uh, thank you to all the guest designers for all their inspiration they give me and others. Tracy from Sheffield. Tracy, that's lovely. And I love your flowers. So do I. What flowers are those? They're not like nasturtiums or something like that. They're very nice, Tracy. Oh, beautiful. It's beautiful. Beautiful. It just works. Doesn't look at that little... Yeah, blues and reds and greens, that's really nice. There. Gorgeous. Lovely. This is stunning. Oh that, my goodness me. That's what you do with a centrepiece yeah. like that, don't you, in the, that court. Um, and this is from Una in Newcastle. Good morning all at Jewelry Maker. What lovely weather we're having and long overdue, I would agree there. Um, I made this piece a while ago with a large piece of agate and adventurine and my favourite, the antique wire. Hope you like it. It's stunning. It's beautiful. It's just perfect oh no that's that beautiful design. it is amazing yeah that's gorgeous, gorgeous. Um, coming up in a few seconds we've got a brand new strand of gems of distinction I like it's gorgeous I like it oh, I love it I love it I like it it's coming up in just a few seconds Buying jewellery online from us has just become even easier with our new streamlined checkout service. We've made some little changes to make our website more accessible for all of the different ways you shop online and now it's even easier using a mobile phone or tablet. Once you have added your items to your shopping basket, you can decide to check out now or save for later. Saving an item for later means you can easily find them in your own time, but don't forget to check back soon as all our items are selling fast. One of just a few changes that will make buying jewellery from us even easier. Here at the Genuine Gemstone Company, we are happy to announce that our studio store is now open. If you attend any of our courses, you can now browse through special items, get exclusive discounts and deals that you can't get at any other time. Become an exclusive customer at the studio store. For more information on available courses and dates, please contact our call centre. The new studio store. The experience just got better.
commitment here at Jury Maker is to provide you with genuine gemstones. Many places might not be able to do that, but we want to guarantee it. So how do we do it? We go to the laboratories and we get tests. We have our own in-house gemologists that can guarantee that when we say genuine gemstones, that's exactly what you're getting. Jewelry Maker course gift vouchers are now available. You can choose from a bronze, silver or gold voucher. Each voucher is worth a different amount that entitles you to put towards a course of your choice. For more information, contact our call centre on 0800 644 655. Do you need a helping hand to get started with Jewelry Maker? Are you stuck for ideas and need inspiration? Then visit our Jewelry Maker website where you can find our video tutorials. Expand your knowledge and skills with these easy to follow jewelry making demonstrations. Whether you're a beginner, hobbyist or business owner, there's always something new to learn. It couldn't be easier. Simply click and learn some new jewelry making techniques. Oh, this is a whopper cheeker of a strand, isn't it? Oh, it really is. What a beautiful strand of gemstones. This is Iolite. Have to say, Linda, I like this. I adore it. I just love the name, Iolite, actually. Iolite. Isn't, it isn't it lovely? Yes. I wonder actually because um, kyanite which is a, a blue gemstone comes from the Greek word kynos which means blue lapis lazuli lazuli is 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 a word for blue I wonder whether iolite I wonder whether the word the name iolite means blue in a in a language it might do yeah we'll have to look up the sort of you can look up the the sort of when I did <laughs> when I did Latin a hundred years ago at school, <laughs> we were taught to look up the first part of the word to see ah. where, it, where it came from. Yeah, maybe. So it might well be. Answers on a postcard. Yes. It's a lovely, lovely gemstone this. Um you may have heard of the word pleochrism. If you have heard of the word pleochrism, then you will almost definitely have heard of the gemstone iolite because iolite is a gemstone which displays some of the best pleochrism of any gemstone what is pleochrism pleochrism is is uh, what iolite has in abundance so when you look at iolite can you see how you're seeing different shades of blue different shades of blue and almost pinks and purples all at the same time in, um, um, uh, from this incredible gemstone. It's a very similar gemstone to tanzanite in that respect in the fact that you do get lots of different blues and you are going to be getting lots and lots of secondary colours as well. Um, and that is just a hint of the quality you're getting here. These gemstones have been individually hand faceted, hand drilled isn't that lustre incredible isn't that quality amazing it's like lapis lazuli but it's got clarity in the fact that it's got lots and lots of different qualities of color lots of secondary tones coming through but it has the most amazing clarity just like um, um which which lapis lazuli can't give you I love it. I think it's really, really wonderful. Often mistaken for tanzanite, often mistaken for sapphire. In fact, it's often mis uh, mistaken for lots and lots and lots of different gemstones because of the different blues which you get, which are reminiscent of quade tanzanite and salon blue sapphire and cashmere sapphire. I just love it. I think it's wonderful. Now, with this particular strand of gemstones, yeah, you will find colours which are reminiscent of quade tanzanite. You will find colours which are reminiscent of your salon blue sapphire and reminiscent of your indicolites however you're going to be getting all that quality and all those gorgeous colors for a price point which is sensational under 20 pounds no 
under 10. Here's your deal today for this Gems of Distinction strand. Now, isn't that incredible? If this was a strand of Tanzanite, if this was a strand of Indicolite, if this was a strand of Salon Bleu Sapphire, there's no way on earth we'd ever be able to bring you a price point of 9.95. The only reason we can bring you this kind of a price point today it's the fact that it's iolite. Now, iolite is still a semi-precious gemstone. You're still going to be getting a hand-faceted, hand-drilled quality. But we work on margins which are ridiculously small here at Jewelry Maker. We give you quality. We give you hand-faceted gemstones. We give you hand-drilled gemstones in this case but we can bring them to you at price points like this. There is no point us hiking those prices up. There is no point us keeping anything extra for ourselves. If we can go lower, we will go lower and we have gone lower. 9.95. Now, Linda, with, with the, the last kit that we had, with the first kit that we had, with the tiaras and fascinators that we've just had as well, this is such a rich, opulent blue, isn't it? Oh, it's absolutely amazing it's so unique as well isn't yeah. it because it's yeah. got silvers and greys and also with that last kit i mean if you imagine you know that flower i just demonstrated in there yes if you imagine going up the neckline with a smaller version of that flower in the eye light would yeah. that be amazing yeah um earrings Oof. oh definitely you know because they're going to be moving if you make them as a drop earring on a, on a little chain that they'll move they will so catch the light won't they just you know day, you know evening light daylight they're, they're just equally as stunning even if you did a bit of wire wrapping and made like a little bead cap for them with oh, um, yeah. out, out of gold plated yeah. or antique bronze or silver wire because it will go with any of the any of the precious metal uh, kind of qualities it's such a luxurious gemstone and people will th people will ask you is it tanzanite is it sapphire it looks like those it's it, 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 it's almost meant to look like those because it's constantly being um mistaken for those gemstones because of the amount of color because it's such a play uh, uh, because it's such a play acroic gemstone and you will see so many blues and so many different tones in this gemstone strand you will often find that it will get mistaken for some of those gemstones like corday tanzanite like Salon Blue Sapphire, like Indicolite. But believe you and I, if it was any of those gemstones in this strand, we wouldn't be looking at 9.95. Stick a couple of numbers in front of that nine, and that would be kind of the price point we'd be looking at. I've got loads of you on the phone lines for this. It doesn't surprise me at all. You are getting opulence and quality for a price point which is just ridiculous. Amazing, amazing genuine gemstone. So just take that one in the center there. Just one in the center. Wire wrap it, make it into a pendant or two of the larger ones. Make them into a pair of earrings, as Linda was suggesting. With a bit of chain, they're going to move. That's an earring and pendant set. And I would never consider selling an earring and pendant set for hand faster gemstones like that for less than 20, 25 pounds. The whole strand is under a tenner. It's incredible. That is why so many of our jewelry makers actually end up making pieces, selling them on and then wanting to start their own business, like, like one of the ladies from, on the Jane Business Academy actually said today. Started off making pieces of jewellery, realised actually, do you know what, I really do enjoy this and I want to get away from the job that I'm in at the minute and start up my own business. That's why she's here today on the Jane Business Academy. And there are so many people who follow that path. There's so much joy to be had out of making jewellery and you can make a little bit of money out of it as well sometimes, which is just fantastic. I definitely get more than one of those strands because we don't have eye light on jewelry maker very often, well, do no, we? No, we don't. You know, and I sort of, I'm almost tempted to sort of set a challenge and try and find that strand elsewhere because I think you'll struggle. Yeah, yeah, so do I. Hugely. Beautiful. Now, Laura's saying it's going to go with our next bundle. Wow. Well, Laura does then. have an eye for colour. She oh, does yeah. have an eye for these kind of things. Aye, aye. Um, Put it with precious metal qualities. I mean, that's going to go with rose gold. It's going to go with silver. It's going to go with yellow gold. It's going to go with even antique bronze, copper. Hmm. What about iolite with, still some of these left, by the way. Hold those lines. Yellow gold colored hematites. Another strand of yellow gold coloured hematite, this time faceted. Now, doesn't that look beautiful? That is so stunning. I know. It's gorgeous, isn't it? It's like the last kit. That last kit just looked opulent. It looked like a million dollars. With the eye light, with these two strands of gemstones, it looks like a million dollars, doesn't it? 
there are certain combinations there are certain combinations of colors and tones and textures and gemstones and you look at them and you think yeah that looks opulent that looks expensive that's gonna and how's it gonna make you feel can you imagine wearing these gemstones together how that's gonna make you feel I've got a lovely 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 pair of earrings that actually Linda made um, from a, a hematite kit and whenever I go to a black tie do I wear a necklace um, from that kit that Linda made and a pair of earrings and I feel like a million dollars there's something about that jewelry that just makes me feel incredible and this color combination I think works so this $9.95 with this you're getting even more a double strand of black tourmaline amazing this is one of the shiniest jet black gemstones that there is it's gorgeous it's shiny it's glossy it's got the most wonderful finish to it um and then these kind of nuggets oh goodness me they're like black diamonds aren't they you're also going to be getting nuggets of black agate as well so black agate nuggets a double strand of black tourmaline two strands of gold colored hematite that looks like a million dollars doesn't it have a look at your price point for this you're gonna love this yeah incredible 11.95 for all of this just beautiful now are you get essentially getting a stash essential bundle here are you going to be getting something which you can put with literally everything well yes in fact you are because you're uh, going to be working with blacks and you're going to be working with uh, you're going to be working with precious metal tones as well so you can put this with whatever you want you can split this bundle up you don't have to use it all together i think all together it looks wonderful especially with the eye light we're going to bring you details for the eye light as well don't forget that was 9.95 i think all together that looks just the most that looks like the most incredible bundle and it really does remind me of the last kit if you missed out on the last kit which was only 19.95 don't forget then by all means come in and get this come in and get this and of course the eye light for 9.95 because i think together that looks just gorgeous doesn't it amazing 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 gorgeous quality there well done ah! now still to come praise your light look how many praise your lights there are in this strand it's mad green amethyst this is one of the cleanest gemstones there is i love green amethyst we just do not get enough of it on jewelry maker in my opinion don't get anywhere near enough of it multicolor beryl this is similar to the strand we had on yesterday in the fact that the colors are so striking the clarities are amazing but with this particular strand the cut is very very different um it it's so sweet it's like a strand of sherbet sweets isn't it? it's beautiful this beautiful strand is going to be coming your way and also amethyst faceted rounds of gorgeous amethyst look at that that is amethyst color isn't it that is the color amethyst should be oh that's going to be coming your way as well now how about a bright pink bundle thanks Cass this summer and last summer um there are some seriously bright colors about aren't there Linda there certainly is yes yeah there's lots and lots of floral prints that are all the hot colors aren't they there are indeed whether you go to oh goodness me whether you go to uh h m or you go to new look or you go to top shop or you go to ted baker or you go to um vivian westwood or you go to you know any of your either designer stores right the way down to your high street chains neon colors are everywhere and it's not just in fashion it's not just in clothes it's in belts it's in shoes it's in nail polish it's in hair it's in it's it's in pretty much every every walk of life it's also in jewelry now you might walk into a shop and look at all those neon colors and go oh goodness me do you know what i i, I love those neon colors but i don't feel confident enough to wear a neon vest or a neon pair of hot pants you know i i want to be able to wear those really really bright gorgeous tones but i only want to have it in a belt or in a hair band or or in something in something a little bit more um using it as an accent more than as a a feature i've got something for you fuchsia pink 
sh um, a, a fuchsia pink quartz this is very very bright very 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 intense and i love it pink color coated quartz now we have brought you lots and lots of coated quartz recently on jewelry maker which has been wonderful some of it um some of it looks like it hasn't been coated it looks almost natural which i really really love some of it like this is unashamedly coated it's like yep yeah, i'm coated i love it i love the fact that i'm bright and beautiful and this is one of those strands and that's what i love so much about it we haven't pretended that this isn't coated we haven't said no 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 it's not coated you know we are being transparent and honest about this and isn't it fun it's incredible isn't it this is fuchsia color coated quartz it's bright it's beautiful and oh my goodness me this with colors like the highlight we just bought you this with blue that looks amazing doesn't it yeah that with the golden black bundle that we've just done as well don't forget why don't we add another strand to this hot pink frosted shell pearl this bundle's about to get even brighter this is awesome frosted shell pearl rounds linda this is bright isn't it yeah but to be honest if you if you do look at all those fabrics in the shops at the minute you always find that that hot pink is the one that everything else seems to work around yeah you know all the citrusy colors the oranges the blues the the lemons they all seem to work around a center of hot pink yeah it's incredible isn't so it? if you put jewelry in hot pink yeah that's the way to wear it if you if you're somebody who isn't necessarily that confident about wearing bright colors and you wear lots of black and you wear lots of white this is how you could get this Definitely. is how you can get these kind of colors into well, your wardrobe you know, isn't it just great for a summer wedding oh um, fantastic yeah because yeah, it, it, it really is the color isn't it for um probably for wedding parties definitely that's definitely the color for mums or even if you're feeling um or even if you're feeling very adventurous and get bridesmaids to wear these colors if they're going to be wearing maybe maybe a very very um simple color in their dress very a simple design in their dress why not give them something like this to wear in their hair i mean why not it's gorgeous it's fun it's it's really really bright and intense and beautiful now two strands here it's called popping candy code is jogc28 enjoy this bundle because it's gonna go here's your price today for these two awesome strands of gems seven pounds 95p now whether you are somebody who's making jewelry for yourself or making it to sell on or you want to look for a couple of bundles to get your kids involved with making genuine gemstone jewelry why not go for something like this it's bright it's beautiful it's really 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 fashionable as well really fashionable and these kind of colors are everywhere at the minute whether it's in accessories or whether it's in uh, fashion whether it's in beauty whether it's in things like nail polish or um or whether it is in jewelry the, the, the colors here are seriously 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 intense and they are so 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 fashionable and they're so popular and they appeal to all people of all ages and can you imagine jewelry made out of this gorgeous bundle on your craft store can you imagine how much attention that's what an attention grabbing piece that's going to be people are going to look at it they're going to come over they're going to hold it they're going to pick it up they're going to go wow she knows or he knows um what is big at the minute she knows or he knows the big trends at the moment and these are part of the big trends color block this mix this up with blues and greens or put it with blacks and if you put it with the last bundle all of a sudden all of a sudden yeah the pink really does pop but it's a lot more sophisticated isn't it it's a lot more sophisticated it's a lot more grown up isn't it it's entirely up to you it's entirely up to you whatever you want to do with this bundle whether you want to put it with greens lime greens and oranges and yellows or whether you want to keep it really nice and sophisticated and put it and, and put it with a bundle like this it really is entirely up to you i think it's great i think it's wonderful making jewelry out of gemstones like this the world's a better place isn't it yay right do you fancy uh, do you fancy seeing the final kit final kit it's a final kit final kit it's a final kit final kit it's a final kit woo 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 check it right Linda woo 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 that's the backing sorry it's all right it it, it worked it did it, it, it worked it worked it? It, yeah. worked it worked here we go final kit everyone it's called 
Butterfly wings. Butterfly wings. Do you like butterflies, Linda? I love butterflies. I like them too. I've got a friend who doesn't like butterflies. How can you not? What's not I to know. like about a butterfly? They don't fly in your face. <laughs> they fly in your face. Hannah, you might have seen Hannah before. I don't know if she's been on during before. Hannah Goddard. She doesn't like butterflies. She, she says they fly in her face. Might fly in her face. I like them. Do you know, I was at my, uh, my, my in-laws Ruby wedding anniversary celebrations over the weekend on Saturday. And we were sitting, um, uh, we was, uh, Ruby's 40 years. And we were sitting uh, having, having drinks and things like that and having, having a buffet and all that kind of stuff. And, um, and I was talking to uh, my husband's uncle and, uh, and a butterfly came in and just landed on the table. It was really pretty. So I told you that. Butterflies are great though, aren't they? They're gorgeous. They're really pretty. They have such pretty Butterfly. Wings. Well, what the, what's wrong with telling the st uh, that story? I get a lot of stick from my team, Linda. I oh, know. I oh, know. It's, it's not. You know, telling really. little stories and you know. Yeah. And they're always so gorgeous. Your stories. I say. They are. <laughs> they are. Well, are you taking the Mickey out of no. me today, Linda? No, 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 no. Just calm down, Linda. Okay. I've only got one more show with you, all right? You have, haven't you? Yeah. Monday. I could make it very difficult you for could, you. Actually, yes. Could just ignore you for the whole four hours. You could. She's probably quite like it, actually. <laughs> I'm just right. Going out to that. Butterfly wings. This is gorgeous. Right. Do you want to see what you're going to be getting? Yes, Carol. Show us the gemstones for goodness sake. Yes. Frosted fluorite nuggets. Now we've had some frosted fluorite last. My friends are looking really long. We had some frosted fluorite nuggets the other week, and um, they look like beach glass. Do you know what I mean by beach glass? You don't see beach glass that often now because of um, because of things like recycling. Um, but um, it's basically glass which has been tumbled. Uh, sorry, that sounded really negative because of things like recycling. Um, so um, it's basically glass which has been tumbled, and all the kind of hard, sharp edges have been taken off. Um, I don't know. I so I find beach. I used to like finding beach glass when I was when I was little, but it is like beach glass. Do you know what I mean? Do you know what I mean? So frosted nuggets of fluorite. These are lovely, lovely gems, aren't they? Really gorgeous greens in here. Beautiful, beautiful colours. Lovely, soft, gentle tones. And do you know what? When the light hits these, these gemstones are going to glow beautifully. They're lovely, lovely, lovely gems, aren't they? Next strand. Light lavender amethyst. A double strand. Pretty much 80 centimetres of light lavender amethyst here. It's almost pink amethyst. It's almost Rose de France, actually, which is lovely. So gorgeous nuggets of Rose de France amethyst. Double strand there. Followed by genuine freshwater cultured pearls. <gasps> now... These aren't fake, they're not synthetic, they are dyed, but they are genuine freshwater cultured pearls. How can you tell? Okay, look at the shape of them. Each one's different, isn't it? That one there's slightly more of a rectangular shape, that one there's more of an oval. That one's more round, that one's more round as well, that one's got more of an oval shape to it. These are genuine freshwater cultured pearls and every single one, I like that one there, every single one, is different. Every single one is, is unique. That one there's got a bit of a flat back to it. That would make a lovely ring, wouldn't it? Don't you think? A lovely idea. So, genuine freshwater cultured pearls in uh, kind of mocha colours, there's greens, there's yellows, very, very soft pastel tones there. These are just so pretty, aren't they? Then, then, mystic hematite. mystic hematite this is where that bright intense color comes in now i cannot wait to see how linda has used this mystic hematite in this kit this is the new variety of hematite which everyone's going crazy over we love it uh, and in this strand of mystic hematite what can you see blues greens pinks oranges yellows violets loads and loads and loads and loads and loads of different colors across this strand it is like oil and water you get that wonderful iridescence it's such a striking strand. And believe you and I, this is gonna be the strand that ties this whole kit together, it's wonderful. Speaking of tying together, you are also gonna be getting loads of threading materials with this kit, including five meters of cobalt blue waxed cord. 
five meters in total there. You're also going to be getting another five meters of silver waxed cord. You're also going to be getting five meters of royal blue ribbon. And you're also going to be getting five meters of baby blue colored ribbon as well. So that's an extra 20 meters of threading materials already in this kit. Pretty amazing, yeah? Then we offer you a color coordinating threading pack. This includes monofilament, blue elastic, and blue color beading thread. Now, I really love it when we can bring you these new varieties of um, threading packs where everything is color coordinated and they go together beautifully and of course they go with the kit. Findings include 98 antique bronze colors copper findings. There they are. Eye pins, head pins, bolt ring clasps, jump rings, toggle clasps, uh, uh, ribbon endings with extended chains, rondelles, spacer beads, uh, a senorita clasp on there as well, crimp beads. There's 98 findings in total there, okay? So, in summary, the equivalent of four strands of genuine gemstones, the equivalent of four strands of gemstones, 98 findings, your threading pack and an extra 20 meters of threading materials. Your price for this kit is incredible. Did we say that there were two kits today going under 20 pounds? We've, the first kit was 27.95. The last kit was 19.95. This is gonna go to 19.95, yeah? Yeah, yeah, brilliant. Sixteen ninety-five. Oh my word! Sixteen ninety-five for this kit. Look at Linda's face. Look at your face. That's a. That's a. What on earth are you going on? Look at that face. Oh dear, Ryan doesn't look very happy either. <laughs> Ryan, what do you think of that price point? £16.95p. Oh no. Oh no. I don't know what I was doing. I'd like words. Oh dear. Ryan's not very happy with that. Well, You've been talking to Bruce? Bruce yeah, we better not tell Bruce. Oh dear. That's a very low price. Right, uh, should we go over and see Linda? Yeah. Linda, do you feel like talking at the minute or not? Oh, or are you yeah, just I mean it's a great it's a great fantastic bargain for um for our customers, but I'm just bothered I might not get paid at the end of the week. I know. It's bonkers, isn't it? Yeah. You get paid for doing this. <laughs> I don't. I just do it for the you love. I do it for the love, so do I. I do it for the so love. Do, so do I actually. Um I love the mixture of the uh, Mystic Hematite with this kit, don't you? Yes, it just <clears throat> um, brings out the rainbow, doesn't it? It does! Yeah. Brings yeah. out the butterfly rainbow. Ew. Yes, exactly. It's got that... Um, it's also dragonfly-y. Yeah! Kind of wings, isn't it? Perhaps it should have been called that. Isn't it just? Oh, that's a lovely necklace, Linda. That's beautiful. Is that just with the... Yes, yeah. I'm oh, just going to wow. quickly demo that, but not with the chips, because you'll be here till tomorrow's show. Yes, Linda, as much as we do love you, I don't want to stand here till tomorrow's show watching One Technique. Um, but that's that's really, really beautiful. So that's with the fluorite. Is it nice to have those fluorites in a, in a frosted quality? Well, you see, I love dramatic gemstone. I mm. love sort of natural look gemstone. When Kirsty came in this morning, she said, oh, look, that's just like sea glass. And she said, God, honestly, she said, you just can't get gemstones. Mm. Um, that are, they're so few and far between, particularly mm. in fluorite, because we normally get all the sort of rainbow colours, don't we? Mm. But this sort of frosted look on it is stunning. And as I say, I love dramatic gemstone. Really, That's really That's one of them. Lovely uh, necklace here as well. Love what you've done with the beading thread. Now, what is this knot that you've done here, Linda? Well, um, that is uh, um, basically it's a square, the square knot on the macrame, mm -hmm. okay? But um, every couple of square knots, just as you come in onto the That's next beautiful. knot, just leave a longer loop, okay? Before you actually, so you've got a loop either side of your lazy strand. Then mm -hmm. do your next knot, and particularly with these, um, with these cords, 
you can, once you've done the next set of knots, you can then squish that next set of knots up and so that they go out like little wings on the side. Mm -hmm. And then the centre is exactly the same, but I've just put beads on the, um, the working strands as well. That's such a lovely, lovely necklace, Linda. This kit at the minute, it has all been allocated. It didn't surprise me at all. 16 95 it's a bonkers price, isn't it? Absolutely. Um, do you know what though, Linda? I'm looking at this kit and I'm looking at all these beautiful pieces that you've made here. I think this is the perfect kit for a mother and child. Yes, or yes. For, um, or, 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 you know, it's, 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 it's got the depth of colour in it and the brightness in it for it to be a kit for, uh, for kids and for, um, and for younger people. But you've also got these beautiful findings and gorgeous necklaces like this are something which may be more suitable for, uh, for, for, for the mum or someone, or, or someone that little bit older. It's a lovely, lovely kit, this one. I think it will appeal to all ages, don't you? I definitely do. Um, and it's also got a real... With the little nuggets and things, we've got a real vintage. Mm. We're able to create some vintage jewellery alongside... Because these um, sort of dramatic um, gemstones, like the fluorite nuggets and that, were very big um, in Victorian era. Very, very big. Mm. Um, and then, of course, the other side of the coin, then we've got the, the fantastic hematite, which without a shadow of a doubt will appeal to children because I've got four nieces. Definitely. And um, the one popped round on Saturday morning when I was working on this kit, and she said, Oh, Aunt Linda, oh. what's that? What's that? And I just said, Well, it's, it's a gemstone. She says, Is it real? I said, Well, yes, it's a gemstone. Oh, <laughs> little poppet. Little poppet. Now, with that in mind, Linda, with that in mind, wouldn't you love to be able to sit down with youngsters and make from this kit really lovely simple pieces of jewelry yep. that they can wear this summer that they've got a real sense of achievement that they've made these beautiful pieces of jewelry especially with the um, gemstones like the rainbow hematite wouldn't you love to be able to sit down with them and make loads of little stretchies well that would be fantastic because with the um, the earlier satin cords that we've, we'd had i mean mum can be using those and creating mum jewelry and you know the stretches are so popular throughout generation anyway but it's just so such great fun because let the elastic show when you've got all this diversity of color particularly if you're using that heme tight now we're going to bring you a very quick deal and then we're going to see a demo with linda um we're going to bring you a very quick deal for all of this you are going to be getting um, one, two, three, how many spools are there? One, two, three, four, five. Ten spools of at least six metres of elastic. So it's at least 60 metres of elastic you're going to be getting there. Gorgeous colours here. And if you just pop this next to the rainbow hematite. See? Yeah, it's beautiful, isn't See? it? See? Just beautiful. Now with your 10 lots of um with your 10 lots of your elastic you are also going to be getting a foam beading mat and a jewelry maker beading tray now how many of these beading trays are you actually using today linda um five five why do you need so many of these beading trays well, I like to put all my working kits onto a beading tray. I can't actually work without them. And that is the honest truth. At home, I've got... Could you pop that on, on the um, board there, just so we can see? Yeah, sure. What you're I using mean, it um, for. I mean, I simply can't work without a beading tray. I mean, you know, my husband will verify that when he gets, when he gets home this evening. There's three of them on the floor mm. in the lounge. Um, and I use them for... Um, the first use is for really is setting out, right? You know, if you want to sort of look at um, a piece of jewellery mm -hmm. and then say, oh, well, in there I'll put one of the pearls, I'll pop a stretch of, even for asymmetric jewellery, because that mm. has a certain amount of balance as well. Um, I'll, I'll pop in um, the nuggets there and then it's just pop in mm -hmm. one of the pearls and see if it works. And if it works on your eye immediately, because you've got that look of a neckline there, you know immediately that's, that's the piece of jewellery that will mm. work. The compartments are great. In the corners, I put my class, I put my head pins and eye pins, mm. my crimp beads and that, because there's nothing worse than having to rummage for a little crimp bead. But if it's there, you can pick it up, absolutely no problem. And it's again, it's an organization and Precisely. it makes your brain feel more in sync with what you're doing. So you're using five of these. So presumably uh, you're using one uh, one for each one of the kits, one for your challenge, and then and then another one yeah, as well. Yeah, another one is for my bits and pieces of extra yeah. findings. Um, 
This still today is going to be brilliant. We will get onto a demo with Linda in just a couple of seconds, but you're going to be getting 10 spools of elastic. You're going to be getting your beading tray and your foam mat as well, which is lovely to put your gemstones on because it's a lot softer. It's a lot softer to put your gemstones um, on um, and also to rest your wrists on as well when you're making those pieces. And a tool dock as well. Oh, wow. A tool dock as well. Now, Linda's using one today. All of our guest designers yeah. use these tool docks. This is basically a plastic, um, a plastic uh, dock you don't get the tools with it but you get the plastic dock to put your tools on uh, linda's using yeah, one just over it's there so so useful it really mm. is you know you just pop all your different tools over the top like that so it's very hand friendly just literally pick them up they're mm. ready to go got a crochet hook in here and a reamer in there several spaces um, for other bits and bobs but again it's an organization mm. um, and if you've got all these pieces which you might think oh are, are they important well yes they are you could also put gemstones on these as well and display your jewellery on them. You could also put, um, use them as earring stands. You could also put tiaras on them as well, couldn't you? you use yeah. it as a, as a display tool as well. It, this would make a great um, present, wouldn't mm -hmm. it, um, for, for an adult or, or for a child, really. I think it'd make a, a great little birthday present. Mm, it so really would. And perhaps include a strand of, of gemstone or something. I think it'd just make a fabulous, fabulous start off your jewellery making. So you've got your 10 spools of elastic, you've got your beading tray, you've got your beading mat, and you've got your tool dock as well. One price today, one price. Enjoy, because this is going to be incredible. Wow. 7.95. Now that is someone's nice. summer holiday taken up there. That is someone's summer holiday with their, with their niece, with their nephew, with their daughter, taken up there because you've got everything organised here. If you do want to multi-buy this, please just go for it. You've got all your elastic there and you've got your tool dock as well to put all your tools on. If you want to add the toolkit to your order to speak to the call centre and live help. And don't forget, we've got loads of gemstone bundles you can add to your order as well today. Do add this onto your order. There's loads of you coming through on the phone lines. This It doesn't surprise me at all. Now, Linda. Demo! Okay, um, we're just going to that necklace that's using all of the chips there at mm. the front is, is um, quite an easy thing to do. Right, but I'm going to do it in the hematite because mm -hmm. it's easier and quicker mm -hmm. um, to thread on um, in front of camera. So basically I started off with a nine, but again with the, with the nuggets you're going to be probably using in the region of about 30 nuggets on each one but I started off with just a circle this first circle here and literally tied that in an overhand knot mm -hmm. then the next one this one that's attached to here is um, put the same amount of gemstone on but don't tie it individually tie it onto Ooh. so I've I've, I've I've popped on the gemstone there okay and then Take it through oh, so these and, are interlinking. and tie it off. Um, and then you have got this interlinking. So just tie it off and simply secure that with clear nail varnish or with um, some jewelry maker glue, okay? And then trim off your edge, okay? Then what I did then was I made another three in exactly the same way. Mm. So we've got the mirror image. So I'll talk you through this next stage because it's mm -hmm. just as easy to talk you through because it's simple. So if I put that like that and we've got another three coming up here, so we've got an even number. So what I wanted to do was to do a V shape here for, mm -hmm. the, for the final drop of the fluorite. So to do that, when you've done your other three, is to make another circle and tie it onto the middle. Mm -hmm. Okay, <clears throat> excuse me, and exactly the same on your other side, tie it onto the middle circle. So you have two hanging down here. Mm. And then finish off with just one complete circle and then put that across both of the two that are hanging there. Yeah. So you, you're going to get sort of um, a triangular half diamond. Ah, so literally lovely. an even number on the top. Take uh, another circle in the center of each. So you're going into the second circle from from the beginning and then you tie them all together the two together with one simple knot and then pop on um your little dangle whichever gemstone that you want to use but it's quite effective that would actually make a really effective um centerpiece wouldn't mm. it with mm. the with the hematite I'm, I'm loving that actually i think it would make a lovely bracelet it would make a lovely choker style necklace as well it's lovely having these interlinking circles it's really beautiful mm. isn't it the Just secret is make your first one and then interlink them as you go. 
With actually, do you know what? It's given me an idea. With these interlinking circles, Linda, would it work with the elastic and you can make a stretchy bracelet yes, out of absolutely, them? Yes, absolutely, definitely. A really good idea. And it would be great. Use, use different coloured elastics mm. as well. Make mm. a rainbow bright one and oh, on, on the on the earlier kit that we demonstrated carol said you know well, you've met some little chance well when you tie off the elastic use your nail varnish or your glue again but leave some spare and drop it and pop a tie on a little gemstone onto so don't cut it right up by the um by the bracelet itself leave the two hanging and dangling and um and put a couple of gemstones on and that is really bouncy it's really really pretty on a on a stretchy actually i think this is a lovely idea so do i yeah it's a great kit for adults it's a great kit for kids and of course if you want to add this deal to your order for 7.95 you're getting your elastic you're getting your tool dock and you're getting your beading tray and your beading mat and you can and you can take this kit even further i just think that's lovely i mean if you that's add the brilliant. tool kit carol you, that's it you don't need anything else except your gemstone you're done you're away. add the tool kit to your order it's only 9.95 speak to the call central live help and we'll be able to add that onto your order in fact i wonder whether we can play that out on our next on our next um on our next little break actually if we could play the tool kit out that would be absolutely brilliant so we can find the code for that um so thank you very much for that Pleasure. let's go over to the wall of fame and see some of your designs <coughs> did the wall of fame i can't remember it's got to be 18 months ago a long time ago isn't it goodness yeah. me uh number 324 here this is lovely this has been sent in by leslie who's from south yorkshire she says hi all at jewelry maker towers this is my entry for this week's wall of fame hope it makes uh i hope i hope, hope it makes my first attempt of marked herringbone weave with beading thread on the earrings and bracelets all made with jewelry maker materials these are rose quartz natural large nuggets and rose quartz plain round beads and pink shell pearl hope you like it i made it for my mum and she loves it leslie that's gorgeous thank you very much for that Cheers. These are good, look at these, aren't they? Mm. Beautiful. All different sort of mediums mm. and techniques going on there. It's great. It's number 327 um, from Pamela. Um, Dear old jewelry maker, sending you my first ever chainmail bracelet. I enjoy watching Mark's macrame, and you can see on the photo it started me off on, on making macrame jewelry. Um, best wishes to Carol and Gherking, and looking forward to the Kylie and Jason show on the <laughs> 23rd. <laughs> and that's from Pam in a very sunny Sheffield. Thanks, Pam. Oh, you have been busy. Beautiful, Pam. Gorgeous. It's going to be gorgeous. Number 325 is from G. I think it's Jean, who says, this is my first entry to the Wall of Fame. Even though I've been watching Jewelry Maker for a while now, I named this set The Goddess Inspired uh, by Mark. Uh, Carol and, and, and the colours uh, scream Greece to me. Yeah, they do. They're really beautiful, really Grecian. Um, the set consists of a goddess bracelet and two pairs of earrings. I use magnesite from Jewelry Maker and the cord and sterling silver findings were out of my stash. I've recently spent way too much on Jewelry Maker which gave me a good reason to enter for a chance to win. Good luck to all who entered. Isn't that gorgeous? I love, I love the goddess I love, bracelet. I it's amazing. I love, it. I love those earrings. Mm, They're mm. stunning, aren't they? Mm. Fabulous. Um, this is a beauty here from. Uh, this is three to eight, and it's from Ida. Um, hello, this is my first entry to the Wall of Fame. It's been only a few months since my first purchase from Jewelry Maker, and since then I've been enjoying so much making jewelry. Um, for this entry, I've selected a bracelet, necklace and earrings made from purple stripe agate, white quartzite and rose quartz hearts, all from Jewelry Maker and silver findings. I uh, hope I can win because I'm loving making jewelry and I would love to buy lots and lots more gemstones. Thanks again for all the lovely deals on Jewelry Maker. Just love them. And that's love from Ida in London. That's lovely, Ida. Thank you, Ida. Good luck. Number 326 here. This is this is exactly the kind of piece we were talking about, about making out of the um, Gelux Gem selection, actually. Yeah, absolutely. Isn't it beautiful? Uh, this is from Helen in Birmingham. He says, uh, hello there, Jewelry Maker team. Here's my entry for this week's Wall of Fame, inspired by uh, the Chips and Nuggets DVD, my version of a bubble bracelet. I would probably be easier to tell you which gemstones I haven't used here, uh, but here goes if I can't remember. White agate, cracker quartz, frosted quartz, blue crystal quartz, freshwater pearls, white shell pearl rounds, uh, cream shell coins, coral and beading thread orphan Jewelry Maker, and moonstone rounds, cream shell, head pins, clasp, extender chain, and jump rings from my stash. This should be going uh, on. Uh, this should be going onto my website for sale, but I think I might keep it. Uh, my own everlasting, 
uh, calorie free ice cream sundae. Uh, lo love all the shows and guest designers. Keep up the great work and good and good luck to Carol and Gherkin. Thanks, lovey. Uh, and that's from Helen in Birmingham. That's gorgeous, isn't that lovely? That's just an exercise in just showing how well all gemstones work together. Mm, isn't it just beautiful? Right. Are you ready? Yes. Shall I draw the? I'll draw the runner-up of the Wall of Fame, and you can draw the winner. Oh. So here is. This week's runner-up of the Wall of Fame. You're going to win £50 credited to your jewellery maker account. Number 297. 297, well done. You've won £50 credited to your jewellery maker account. Congratulations. Miss, uh, Michelle Solak, you've won £50 credited to your jewellery maker account. Well Woo. done, Michelle. There we go. And the winner. Good luck. Good luck, everyone. And it's number 318. Number 318. And Abby Prescott Bird, what a lovely name. <laughs> you have won £100 credited to your jewelry maker account. So well done to you two ladies. Oh, Abby, lovely. I think, is that not the lady that did the um, rocking horse? Oh, um, it's not, is it? I think it may be. Forgive me if I'm wrong, but I do recognise it from seeing it on Facebook. Oh, it might be. And says, so. Well done. We had a lovely wall of fame oh, entry from amazing. a lady who made a rocking horse out of wire. It was the most incredible piece of wire work I think I've ever seen in my entire life. So if it is you, congratulations. Yes. If not, better luck. Yes. So, Sorry. there we go. So, fantastic. Well done. We've got a multicolour barrel coming up in just a few seconds. You do not want to go anywhere. It's all about to kick off on Jewelry Maker. Join guest designers Debbie Bulford and Rachel Norris to explore the endless possibilities of combining polymer clay and wire work. This DVD includes a bubble necklace, a heart-shaped pendant, the leaf technique and a butterfly pendant. Advance your designs and fuse your talents together with this amazing DVD. To get your hands on a copy, contact our call centre on 0800 644 655. Get creative with Jewelry Maker. We all know you need the right tools for the job, so here at Jewelry Maker, we have designed a kit to make sure you have all the essentials to join in with the fun. With round nose, flat nose and wire cutter pliers, as well as a reamer, tweezers and a bead scoop, you've got everything you need in one place for just $9.95. We provide the tools, you provide the skills. Join jewellery maker and specialist guest designer Louise Jacobson for our basic wirework course. This class is suitable for complete beginners who wish to learn simple wire wrapping techniques to create stunning structural designs. Louise will teach you all the essential skills to get started, including basic spirals, double connectors and much, much more. The full course includes a range of different wire gauges, a bead scoop, use of all relevant tools, a buffet-style lunch and refreshments, a tour of the studios, a chance to meet the presenters and a visit to our Gemstone Museum. All of this for just $69.95. For more information, contact our call centre on 0800 644 655. Jewellery Maker, bringing out the designer in you. Maker is part of the Genuine Gemstone Company for a reason. If we're going to offer you gemstones, then they have to be genuine. But the only way we can guarantee that is by getting a lab test. This guarantees that you're going to get genuine gemstones, and that's exactly what you deserve.
Tune in to Joymaker on the 23rd of July for Carol's last show. And to celebrate, we're having a Kylie and Jason themed show? Wait, is that right? Uh, yeah, it was Mark's idea. Okay. Anyway, make sure you're watching for a fun-packed show with amazing products, lots of fun, and of course, Carol's singing. La, 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 la. Come and learn all about silver clay with international art clay instructor Natalia Coleman. This workshop will guide you through the basics of using silver clay, including how to plan your designs, cutting and shaping, firing and polishing. The full course includes 20 grams of art clay, use of all relevant tools, a buffet style lunch and refreshments, a tour of the studios, a chance to meet the presenters and a visit to our Gemstone Museum. All of this for just £109.95. For more information, contact our call centre on 0800 644 655. What a stunning strand of multicolour barrel. Oh my goodness me. I feel so, so, so lucky to be able to bring this to you today. This really is gorgeous. Um, we, we love bringing you multicolour barrel here on Jewelry Maker. It's, it's one of those gemstones which just brings you um, colours which are reminiscent of some of the biggest and most coveted gems in the world, such as your emerald, your aquamarine, your morganite, your goshenite, your heliodor. Um, we brought you a strand yesterday on Jewelry Maker of a beautiful strand of uh, multicolour barrel. It was wonderful and the clarity and the faceting was just beautiful. I have to say, I think this strand is equally as good. I honestly do. I think it's just beautiful. Can you see the morganite you are getting on this strand? In fact, Kerry's showing the centre of the strand there perfectly. Can you see this morganite? Look at how beautiful that is. It's exactly the colour I would expect to get in a piece of jewellery if it was set into 18 karat or 9 karat gold. That morganite is just out of this world, isn't it? It's a beautiful pink variety of beryl. It's the manganese in the gemstone, which gives it the most wonderful, delicate, pinky colour. And it's the iron and the, uh, and the cobalt inside uh, beryl, which gives it the blues, which turn it into aquamarine. It's, the, it's, the, um, it's uh, also iron and other metallic elements in, in a beryl, which give it a gorgeous emerald quality. It's the most wonderful genuine gemstone family, isn't it? And I have to say, be uh, beryl can sometimes be a gemstone, a little bit of compromise in the fact that sometimes it has great clarity, but not much color. Sometimes it has great color, but not much clarity. But here in this strand, not only are you getting that awesome color, but you're getting moments of impeccable clarity. Some of the best clarity I've seen in beryl. Really is tremendous, isn't it? Now, because this is obviously a very, very, very special strand, it's all been hand faceted, it's all been hand drilled, it's all very, very, um, you know, it, 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 it's been through a very specialist process. This is obviously going to be a much more considered strand of gems of distinction gems than ones we've seen over the last few weeks, yeah? No. In fact, your price today for this genuine multicolour beryl strand gems of distinction where you are going to be getting morganized effectively you are going to be getting colors reminiscent of your emeralds and your and your aquamarines and your goshenites today this is your price some of the best quality multicolor barrel i have seen on jewelry maker and that's your deal today under 15 pounds it's just beautiful isn't it such a gorgeous quality 
Now, Lindy, you know what I mean. Sometimes beryl can be um, a gemstone of compromise. Sometimes it's got great colour but no clarity. Sometimes it's got great clarity, no colour. But here you've got the colour and the clarity, haven't you? And the sparkle. Yeah. The sparkle from it. Um, I love beryl. So do I. I love morganite, I love aquamarine. Um, but what strikes me about that strand is the, the cut. It's unusual. Definitely. It's, it's just perfect. As you've got it now, it's perfect for a bracelet. Yeah. Because it will stand and it'll, because it's those little cuts on the side. Look at the sparkle coming off of it. You could graduate those colours. Yes. Not only that, but on Saturday, I don't know if you're watching the show on Saturday, Linda, but on Saturday we had a great deal for um, pastel coloured setting, um, um, satin cord. Yes. It would look great interest. with those satin cords. Absolutely beautiful. I mean, it is a, uh, just, you just need to restrand it if you want to really sort of go and, and be sort of really generous with it if it's for you just restrand mm. it but you know what you've got tons of pairs of earrings on there oh you do and, and little centerpieces um set into silver chain would look stunning yeah definitely um just sort of mix and match really perhaps do a, one tiny little busy piece and then mm. lots and lots and that's going to go such a long way and again really learn the um like, you know, you've just educated us on, on, on the whole Beryl family and that. And if yeah. you just learn that little bit of information, yeah. you, know, you can give to people that are buying, or even people that you're giving it as a gift. Yes, absolutely. It's so nice. Yeah. Um, you've you've got a gemstone here, which, um, as, as, as Linda said, will make great earrings because of the way that they stack together. Can you imagine getting one of the Morganites, one of the green uh, kind of emerald coloured ones, one of the kind of aquamarine ones, and stacking them together and making a very simple drop pair of earrings? I mean, that could be a pair of earrings yourself for £15. The whole strand on its own is under £15. You know, it's really, really lovely. Or if you're the kind of person who makes um, their own stud earrings, you can make beautiful stud earrings out of these as well, and you're going to get all that luster, all that quality, be really, I, mean, I, I I would be quite indulgent with this strand. I'd probably buy a couple of strands of these. I'd make one into jewelry to, uh, to sell on and I'd probably keep one for myself because emerald is my favorite gemstone. Morganite's in my top five, so is aquamarine. Um, and you've and you've got a gemstone strand here which gives you all of those wonderful qualities. Um, I'd, I'd, I'd be keeping that for myself. I honestly would do. So I'd definitely come in and get two. Just love it, well done. Now, from one amazing strand to another, now this is a gemstone that we do not see often enough on Jewelry Maker, in my opinion. Um, um, we just do not see it often enough. It cannot be mistaken for any other gem in the world. Simple. I'm talking about the green variety of amethyst. I'm talking about praiseolite. Um, now, praiseolite is a gemstone which is unlike any other green gem. It's clearer than praenite. It's softer than peridot. It's got more brilliance than chrome dioxide. And do me a favour, when you um, have a few minutes over the next few days, go onto the internet and type into a search engine, any search engine will do, um, the Dresden Diamond. The Dresden Diamond is a genuine, and I think it's a naturally coloured green diamond, a faceted diamond. It's very, 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 very famous one of the world's largest faceted diamonds and it's green. These green amethysts here are almost exactly the same colour as the Dresden diamond. Why? What makes these what makes these so similar to the Dresden diamond? Okay, well obviously a diamond. What does a diamond have? What does a diamond have by the bucket load, a great quality diamond I'm talking about, you know, kind of museum quality diamond. What is it gonna have? It's gonna be clear, yeah? It's gonna be transparent. It's gonna be like looking at crystal. It's gonna be like looking at glass. It's gonna be undoubtedly sparkly as light enters the gemstone, splits into its, in, 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 into its components, into its colors, so blues, greens, reds, magentas, and then it reflects back out at you in something called fire or dispersion. You're getting that kind of quality here, aren't you? Are you getting that sparkle? Yeah. Are you getting that bright white brilliance? Yeah. Are you getting that silvery green color similar, almost exactly the same as the Dresden diamond? Yeah. Are you getting a lot on this strand? Yeah. You are getting dozens of gemstones on this strand. 
11, 12, 13, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, 20, this is equally as, if not more glamorous than a diamond because of its soft silvery colour, because of its gentle glow, because of its bright white brilliance, because of its incredible faceted quality here as well. We would never be able to bring you, in, in fact, I, I, the Genuine Gemstone Company would never be able to bring you a strand of green diamonds like this, never. If this was a strand of green diamonds, you wouldn't be looking at tens or even hundreds or even thousands. You'd be looking at millions of pounds worth of diamonds. And a little bit like the highlight earlier on, this could be mistaken for green diamonds. This could be uh, mistaken for some of the highest end gems the world has ever known. Today, your strand of hand faceted, chunky drop, briolette cut, Genuine green praiseolite is going even lower than the barrel. Here's your price. £12.45p. Now, in my personal opinion, because I'm such a fan of praiseolite, we do not see this gemstone enough on Jewelry Maker. I've only been able to bring you praiseolite, oh, I don't know, maybe eight or nine times this year so far. We need to see more of it. I think it's so effortlessly beautiful, so effortlessly glamorous, and it goes with so many other gemstones. Um, Linda, have you used Praise Your Light much? Is this a gemstone you've used a lot in your jewellery or not? Or what well, have you used it with? I haven't been able to get my hands on it mm. particularly. And, and at that level, I want to get my hands on that. You know, when I see a strand like that, I, you can't believe how much comes into my head and how much I really yeah. want to work with it. Um, it's got everything that I look for a gemstone. It's got it's got that clarity. It's got that superb, unique colour, mm. which is an asked about colour. Or oh, what's that? Because it's mm. an unusual colour. You don't see that colour very often. Mm. Um, it's got the sparkle, and it's um, it's got that beautiful sort of little squashed sort of teardrop shape yeah. that looks so stunning on an earring drop. Um, or you know when you do necklaces that are graduated drops absolutely put yes. one of those on the end and uh, say some black um, <sighs> onyx or something like that and that would just be so heavenly mm -hmm. it is it is it is such a lovely shape for necklaces it, as you say it's got that gorgeous kind of squashed teardrop shape which is perfect for earrings Beautiful. as you said um, with smoky quartz, with black agate, with gold, rose gold, silver. My only little bit of advice for you with this strand is, when you get it home, look at it, hold it. Don't do anything with it straight away, just look at it. Just feel the gemstone and just, and just, really, and just really think about how you're gonna use this gemstone strand. It's one of my favorite gemstones. It's one of um, 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 jewelry makers' favorite gemstones, but unfortunately we just do not get enough of it on the show. Make the most of it and really give this one some thought because that's a stunning strand and the most amazing prize bag. I can't guarantee the next time it's gonna be on air. I can't guarantee it's gonna be 12.95. I can't guarantee it's gonna be this kind of faceted briolette shape. And I can't guarantee you're gonna be watching. So make the most of it now, make the most of it now. Gorgeous. Right, to go with that gorgeous strand of praise your light, how about a three strand pack of Prey Night? In different sizes. Um, I love bundles like this, Linda. I don't know about you. I love bundles like this. I love graduated necklaces, graduated yeah. pearl necklaces, probably the simplest um, piece of jewelry in the world, a graduated pearl necklace. Exactly. Um, I think when we do get bundles that contain three strands of the same gemstone, yeah. I think you should get that, particularly as for the reason that you've just said, a graduated necklace. But when you start to use a strand of gemstone whichever it is mm. you sort of it's a bit like knitting quickly because you think if you knit quickly it's gonna your ball of wool is gonna last longer but you know it never happens <laughs> obviously science determines other, otherwise but it's the same with a strand of gemstones but if you've got three strands of the same gemstone you yeah. know you can relax and make wonderful jewelry yeah exactly um, you've got gemstones in here suitable for earrings, necklaces, bracelets, the whole the whole jewellery making spectrum because of course you've got three different sizes. You're getting Prey Night in four to five millimetre rounds, six millimetre rounds, 
and eight millimeter rounds. So three different sizes of Praynite here, which just work beautifully together, don't they? They really, really do. You're gonna be getting jet black inclusions going through some of these as well, which is just lovely. And it allows you to appreciate, hopefully, the quality of what you're gonna be getting. Um, Praynite with Praseolite. Have a look at it with the Praseolite, in fact. Why not? Mm. See, I think they'd work beautifully oh, together. Yes. Similar color, but you can see the Praseolite's got um, a lot more clarity. It's got a, a it's a lot clearer a gemstone. Wouldn't it be lovely to be able to add these onto your order? Now the Praisier light, that was 12.95, yeah, and 12.45 even. Wouldn't it be lovely to add this bundle onto your order and be able to make tons and tons and tons and tons, tons of jewelry for under, oh, I don't know, 24, 25 pounds. That'd be brilliant, wouldn't it? It's gonna happen. Here's your deal. Today for your Prey Night bundle, three strands, four, six, and eight mil rounds. Here's your deal. 11.95 and like I said it's not very often on Jewelry Maker that we have the chance to bring you three of exactly the same gemstones in different sizes four mil six mil eight mil just love it well done not only that but you're also going to be getting a free phone number 0800 655 you're also only paying 2.95 p and per order I just love it I think it's amazing I really 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 honestly do just gorgeous well done don't forget it is a free phone number from your BT landline there You've got gemstones in here for your earrings, for your necklaces, for your bracelets, and um, fantastic as well for wedding jewelry, for tiaras, for hair slides as well, because don't, don't forget if you have flowers at any of these events, you're gonna have greens there. So green is always a fantastic color to go for. You can add it to any other color you want, because of course you get every other color in nature. Gorgeous, well done. Now, 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 now. I've got another bundle. So, we bought you a bundle a little bit earlier on with tiaras and combs in. Sold out. Sold out, I'm sorry, it sold out. How about we bring you another one? How about we bring you another bundle with tiara bands, five tiara bands, five tiara blanks, there they are gold colored tiara blanks five of them there you go and wire now 100 meters Ooh, so not 10 not 20 not 15 100 meters of 0.25 millimeter ga uh, gauge gold plated copper wire now, 0.25 millimetre in gauge, Linda. What is this? This is the finest wire we can offer on Jewelry Maker. What is your 0.25 millimetre gauge great for? Uh, it's great for winding on. So it's great for winding on to um, tiaras. Popping okay. the gemstones on and then wiring on. And then obviously if you do what we call a, um, a tiara twist, it's very malleable to mm. you know, pop your gemstones and twist down. Um, so it's great for that. If you, want it, if you want to use it for a little bit more, slightly more structure, then use your wire twister, we say four or six mm. um, of uh, strands of it. And then, you know, you just multiply it by the, the amount of strands you've got and that's what you'll end up with. And that actually 0.25 on a wire twister looks fabulous. I bet it does. Absolutely fabulous because you can get like, f say five strands, well, certainly onto the twister you can get five strands. Ooh. And now the light bounces off that. Is, is stunning. So it's a perfect partner with the tiara, uh, Absolute with the tiara perfect blanks. Part, without a doubt. Yeah, without a Ooh, doubt. Ooh, fantastic. Not only that, but you can probably use this with smaller gemstones, with some of the gems of distinction yes. gems, some of the pearls that we've had on today's show as well. Lovely. Now, with the prey night that we just bought you for 11 95 perfect partner for those. Don't you think? Perfect partner with the prey night. So, five tiara hair blanks. Okay. Five in total. Yellow gold coloured and 100 meters of 0.25 millimeter gauge gold plated copper wire. The last tiara and, and uh, comb bundle we bought you sold out. It's pretty much sold out. There may be two or three left, but pretty much sold out. Your deal today for this bundle, you are gonna love this. Here's your deal. 9.95. Boom, it's incredible, isn't it? It's absolutely wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. I don't have the hair, your hair combs as well. I don't have the hair combs. No way! Five gold hair combs as well! With these hair combs and these tiara blanks, you are surely spurning us, Mr. Still. Says the Aunt Bessie there. 
<laughs> Sorry, that was a rubbish accent. Have you got five of the ye yellow gold coloured hair combs, Cass? Yeah. Can I have them, please, sweetheart? Apparently they're with this deal. It's amazing. Nine ninety five for five of your tiara blanks, five of your hair comb slides in yellow gold coloured, and a hundred meters of your wire as well. Incredible. That is awesome. Isn't that great? Thanks, Cass. That's great. So here are your hair combs. Five of those as well. We really are spoiling you, aren't we, with these incredible kind of bridal and prom inspired deals as well. Not only that, Linda, but I think I think people off the back of um, um, what has and um, what has undoubtedly been a very very busy kind of wedding and prom season, because because a lot of weddings, a lot of proms have kind of been and gone, are stocking up for next year, or stocking up for autumn and winter and Christmas uh, proms and weddings, aren't they? Yes, definitely. And I mean, you don't. Um Anybody who's got long hair and wants to sort of, um, going out on the evening, wants to make a bit more sophisticated, mm. the combs are great, because if you have, which is getting really trendy now, the the, uh, the original French pleats. Ooh, and yeah. And Mad Men and that on telly yeah. with all the 50s and 60s. Um, and that comb is just so great to put into the side. Definitely, yeah. yes. Ooh, fantastic. Just, just, just lovely. So 100 metres of your wire, not 10 or 15 or 20 metres, 100 metres of your 0.25 millimetre gauge wire. Use it with the wire twister tool if you've got that. Um, or you can you can actually manually twist it yourself if you want. Just tie five strands of the wire onto something like a doorknob um, and twist it. Just twist it yourself. You don't have to use the wire twister tool if you haven't got it. Um, and uh, not to mention which, you've got your you've got your ten accessories as well. You've got your five hair slides and your five tiara hair bands as well, and all for less than ten pounds. I think that's absolutely tremendous. Well done, great deal there. Free phone number from a BT landline, and not only that, you're only paying two ninety five p and p per order. Love it. I'm loving all these deals today. Thanks. I'd love a bit of colour, yes, please. You are spoiling me with these amazing colours today. Tell you what, it's meant to be like, you know, the, the, the chocolate advert, you know, with the just rubbish. It's just rubbish, isn't it? And, and, and the accent, it just, it doesn't sound French at all. It sounds kind of, I don't know, kind of not any country I've ever been to. Sounds a bit Pink Panthery. Ah, ah Peter ah, Sellers. Yes, ah, it's better yes. closer. I absolutely love it. I love it. <laughs> Don't you love the scenes yeah. where he goes back to his apartment and yeah. Kato yeah. has kind of set traps for him? It's just so funny, isn't it? <laughs> Kato! Yeah. Oh, it's oh. so funny. He tries to strangle him and everything. <laughs> so funny. Peter Sellers. Um, is he dead now? Yes, he's been dead a while. Oh, yeah. Peter Sellers, such a, such a, such a funny man. Right. Do you want some colour? Bit of colour? Go on then. This goes with your dress, Kerry. You must stop wearing clothes that suit our bundles. <laughs> it's a lovely maxi dress that, that uh, Kerry's got on today. Your mother got it for you. Your mother got it for you. Your mother is a lady of impeccable taste, Kerry. It's very pretty. It's very pretty. <laughs> right. Frosted shell pearl cream. Uh, frosted, frosted cream. Cream frosted shell <laughs> pearl plain rounds. <laughs> <coughs> there we go. There you go. There we go. So these are formal rounds. You don't normally see shell pearl in these kind of sizes, do you, Linda? They're normally bigger, aren't they? Yes. You know, um, Sheila and I were uh, were nagging upstairs forever oh. about getting the small pearls in. Yeah. And um, at last, it's happened. I know. They're beautiful, and they're frosted. Frosted shell pearl plain rounds. Then dusty blue frosted shell pearl. Oh, these. Oh, these sound nice. 10 millimetres in one. diameter. Ooh, dusty, dusty blue. So dusty blue frosted shell. I don't know why I didn't like that. 10 millimetre plain rounds, they're lovely, aren't they? So you get that gorgeous softness, that kind of diffused quality of shell pearl. Now, we could go down the route of Praise Your Light and put something really light and fluffy with it and lovely and kind of um, 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 uh, blush with it and pastely with it. Let's see, that would look lovely, wouldn't it? Or we could chuck a bit of colour blocking in, which is what we've done. Orange shell pearl. Oh, hello. One of my all time favourite colour combinations is orange and blue. I think it looks incredible. All of these colours, all of these textures together. Doesn't that look gorgeous? Lovely bit of colour blocking there. 
Love, 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 love this. Now, by all means, separate these strands out. You don't have to use them together. These bundles are put together with savings in mind, not necessarily for you to have to use them together. Once you get it home, you don't have to use any of these together if you don't want to. You separate them out. Oh, we've got some lovely jewelry that's been made by Rosanna. Oh, she put a little heart on the label. That's nice. So, um, beautiful jewelry that's been made up by Rosanna. Look at these pieces. Are they lovely? I like that. I like these earrings as well. They're really pretty. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. So, three strands of gemstones, one great price. Laura, are you going to go low? Yes. Here's your price. You're going to love this. Seven ninety-five. Boom. Three strands of gemstones for under seven ninety-five. Now. Was it kind of earlier on this year that we started to do three strands of gemstones for kind of nine ninety five, <clears throat> and that was you know as low as I'd as I'd really seen on Jewelry Maker for bundles like that, um, um, and that was kind of what you know three three pounds thirty one a strand. This is seven ninety five for three strands now. That's even lower. That's even lower. I can't quite believe that. That's amazing. It's just over two pounds a strand. What a treat for you today. Just incredible. Well done. So you've got your orange shell pearl, your dusty frosted blue uh, shell pearl, and your cream frosted shell pearl playing rounds as well. And all for under eight pounds. What a whopper treat. Oh, I'm loving it. Well done. Hold those lines. Next. Bright colours. Bright colours. Oh, Linda, we've got the bright colours. We've got the bright colours. We've got the bright colours. Jolly Scooper. Oh, we have to. We've got an art show together on Monday, haven't we, Linda? Yes, we have. We're just talking about what we're going to get dressed up as. I mm. am definitely going to draw a moustache on my face. <laughs> or I might just not have a shave. And uh, I might get my ear cut off. Not Go me. for it! Go for it, my ear cut off. Get your ear cut off! Mm. Be like Van Gogh. Yes, Van Gogh. Van Gogh. Um, I might wear a beret. I think I think we should both wear berets. berets but not okay. kind of Frank Spencer style, but kind of like in a cool <laughs> kind of uh, uh, beatnik kind of way. Have you got berets? Laura's got berets. Oh, Laura's going to hopefully issue us with berets. Brilliant. Um, what else do we need? Maybe like a little neckerchief thingy. Yes, we need yes. Neckerchief. And I'm yeah, definitely going to wear them. I'm definitely going to draw them a stash on. I think we should do some painting as well, just to show your extra talent. Shall we? Shall we? <laughs> Finger painting. Should we draw all the um, VTs for the jewellery? <laughs> Sorry, no, we wouldn't sell a thing. It's a silly idea, Linda. Sorry. Stupid idea. Right. <laughs> this bundle's called Wow! That's some colour! <laughs> Laura, that's an amazing name. That's an amazing name for a bundle. Wow! Exclamation mark. That's some colour. What are you going to be getting? Okay, these are all agate strands. They're all six mil agate strands. And you're going to be getting greens, blacks, um, oranges, yellows, reds, blues, the whole lot. Times three. Look at those colours. Oh, yeah. I would love a selection of stretchy bracelets made out of these, wouldn't you? Wouldn't that just be good? Cool? I'd just keep those colours mixed up. I wouldn't even graduate them. I'd just keep them all mixed up. They look great together, don't they? If you're somebody who wears lots of black or a lot of white or a lot of grey, a lot of kind of neutral colours, these, you know, this is how you can get colour in your life. It's wonderful. Do try this out. Three strands here of multicolour agate, six millimetre plain rounds. JFGC uh, two six. Great if you're going to be making lots of pieces over the summer holidays. Great if you want to give lots of people a selection of gemstones to work with. If you're going to be buying lots of gemstones for other people to work with, something like this is perfect. Come in and get two or three of this bundle. Why not? Here's your price. <gasps> Laura. Laura. I know it's an art taster, but don't blame Linda. Don't bring Linda into this. That works out. She's blaming this price point on you. Is she? Um, this works out to about two pounds thirty-one a strand. Wow. Again, you see, you've got three strands of the same gemstone and the same size. Fantastic. I know. I know. Fantastic. I know. You know, don't you? I just think that's great. Fantastic. Well done. 
6.95 for all three strands. That is incredible, Laura. I love you. I love you, Laura. <laughs> She says she loves us too. Oh, good. That's nice. Six pounds ninety-five p. If you want to see more amazing deals like this, you, you've got to be watching on Monday. It's the art show, and you're going to get to see Linda and I with moustaches as well and berets. That was going to be hilarious. I'm not going to have to look at you for the whole show. Can you so. please have like a Burt Reynolds moustache? And I'm going to give like a pencil moustache. No, I'm going to have a. And I'm going to have a squadron leader's moustache. <laughs> <laughs> a big curly one. one right what, 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 what? <laughs> 6 95 for all three strands. Well done. A handlebar moustache. That'd be yeah. awesome. Well done. Brand new strand. Brand new strand. It's a brand new strand. Brand new strand. It's a brand new strand. Brand new strand. It's a brand new strand. Woo, woo, woo. Oh, they're having a little dance in the sing song in the workshop room. <laughs> oh, they're not anymore. Well, they were. They were, I promise you. <laughs> right. <sighs> Amethyst faceted rounds. Do you know what, Linda? I was saying yesterday. I was only saying yesterday. Um, with, if you had every shade of purple in front of you, every conceivable shade of purple in front of you, so blue purples, red purples, pink purples, and somebody said to you, what colour is amethyst? I'd point at this colour. Yeah, it's a regal purple, isn't it? Yeah. It's an amethyst purple. It's amethyst purple, definitely. That is amethyst purple. And we all know, as, as, as you know, from looking at the strands that we've seen today, there are loads and loads and loads of different colours that amethyst can come in. But this is, for me, amethyst purple. I love it. Now, Kerry, would you count yourself as a gemologist? I'm getting there. She says she's getting there. Did you know anything about gemstones before you came to the Genuine Gemstone Company? I didn't. No. But I bet you'd heard of amethyst before. She said she has. She says she has. She'd heard of amethyst before she came here. It's a household name. It's beyond a household name. It's 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 something which we see all the time on the high street, on the internet. You see it. You see it um, in genuine gemstone jewelry that maybe your friends and family wear. Isn't it lovely to have? Isn't it lovely to have amethyst in its really intense, very, very dark, very, very sumptuous colour. Brand new today. Faceted rounds of genuine amethyst. Is this from Brazil, uh, Laura? Or is it from Africa? Africa. Oh, see, this looks very much like the Coloma Mine Amethyst that we've had before on Jewelry Maker. But it could be Coloma Mine Amethyst. Doesn't say that it is, though, but colour-wise it could be, couldn't it? Brand new today, we're gonna go low. Would you like to see your price today for genuine amethyst? And in my opinion, what amethyst looks like, what amethyst in my mind's eye looks like. To go with the amethyst hearts we bought you yesterday, here's your price today. <laughs> Any minute now, any moment now. 12.95, there you go. 12 pounds and 95p for your gorgeous amethyst. There you go, what an incredible deal. Yep, 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 yep. Well done. Under 13 pounds for your superb, for your superb amethyst faceted rounds. This is so exciting, well done. What a gorgeous price point for you today. It's regal, it's beautiful, it's faceted, it's just sumptuous and juicy, isn't it, Linda? Just like you. <laughs> Juicy. Um, Juicy. Yeah, the girl I said on Sunday, um, the girl that does my nails, she's oh. an absolute, she only wears amethyst. She doesn't oh. wear diamonds, she doesn't wear anything else. She oh, just interesting. wears amethyst. And um, she wears that really, as you've just said, amethyst colour. Mm. She wears that deep one. She would love those because they're faceted. Yeah. Absolutely. Because it's not that often that you see in the high street a faceted amethyst. Sometimes you get amethyst which is so dark in colour, if it's not faceted, it looks almost black. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah. But with this, because it is faceted and it is that kind of black currenty colour, you still get that colour. Oh, it's beautiful. Now, um, I don't actually know how to break this to you. Just to give you an 
idea how much jewelry maker has grown over the last year. We've had to move warehouses. We've had to move vaults. Our vault is now a couple of miles up the road. Ed. Ed is the uh, baby bell of Jewelry Maker. He's one of the managers of Jewelry Maker. Has literally peddled up to the vault up the road to get a ribbon pack that is brand new. When I say this is brand new, this arrived in our vault at about half past 10 this morning from a shipment that has been shipped over by ship. <laughs> I know, it's incredible, isn't it? <laughs> Things do still come to this country via ship, on ship. Um, and it's your chance to come in and get this today. Today. You are the first people ever to see this brand new ribbon pack. Right. It's going to go. Unfortunately, it's not all beautifully displayed. I'm sorry. What can we do? It arrived in the building literally two hours ago. Okay, now, I'm so excited about this. I just can't wait. Oh, I'm going to make a, unicorn, a unicorn's tail out of this. I want to make... Oh, my goodness me. Right, okay. So, do you know the pastel um, satin cord that we bought you on, uh, on Saturday? Yeah, remember that? That sold out, yeah? So we had about five or 600 of those. Uh, they sold out. Today, guess what we've got to go with the, uh, with the pastel satin cord? Pastel ribbon. This is amazing. Five me okay, is it five meters of each? I don't even know what the lengths are here. 10 meters, 10 meters of, sorry Cassie, you're gonna hate me for doing this. 10 meters of minty green colored satin cord. Sorry, not satin cord, um, um, rib organza ribbon. 10 meters of buff colored organza ribbon. 10 meters of baby blue colored organza ribbon. 10 meters of coral colored organza ribbon. 10 meters of pink coloured organza ribbon, 10 metres of yellow coloured organza ribbon, 10 metres of white coloured organza ribbon, 10 metres of, oh that's a different kind of green, aquamarine coloured um, um, organza ribbon, 10 metres of, oh wow this is beautiful, maroony coloured organza ribbon and 10 metres of gold coloured organza ribbon. You are going to be getting 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 110, 100 meters. One of them, I've got one too many. No, sorry, I do beg your pardon. 100 meters of organza ribbon. 100 meters of organza ribbon. This is brand new today. Brand spankers today. It literally arrived on a lorry this morning at half past ten. It's come vi it's come on boat from China and it arrived in the country. Well, sorry, it arrived in our vault today at half past ten. This is gonna go brand new. Here's your price. Ah! Oh! 6.95! Ribbon tastic, Linda. Yeah, and to be honest, that's my favourite one. The coral one's my favourite. Every single colour there. I think I've only ever seen the blue, the baby blue. That's all I've ever seen. You haven't seen yeah. any of the others. I've never seen the gold. Don't think yeah. I've ever seen the maroon. No, haven't no, seen no, the. Haven't. Um, haven't seen the aqua. Might have seen white before. Oh yes, I can um, see that one. Don't think, I've never seen no, the pink or that yellow. Not, Certainly never seen this that, coral. No. I've seen, yeah, I've seen I've the seen baby one. blue, yeah. but I don't think I've seen those either. No, definitely not. Kumahimo, macrame, crochet, knitting, knotting, tying up, tying up, um, tying up birthday presents, making birthday cards out of these, weaving them together and making belts, making curtain tie backs for these, making uh, little frilly bits to go on tops making beautiful um, um, edging to go on bridesmaids dresses, making edges for uh, making edges for cushions, sewing these, using these. Are you a seamstress? It's not just jewellery making that these are 
that these are intended for you can use them for whatever you want what a treat today linda is not that incredible it's fantastic and there's so much use of um ribbon and textile now in jewelry yeah. that that is um is a great stash to have there mm. fantastic. just wonderful isn't it well done under seven pounds for a hundred meters of organza ribbon i just think that's incredible that gold there is so sumptuous isn't it it's amazing that's my favorite one there that kind of coral apricot color just love it that goes so well with that as well <gasps> look at those three together that lovely that. um that lovely mint with the green amethyst earlier. yeah oh yeah with the green amethyst we had earlier on look at those mm, beautiful see look at that gorgeous oh wow. la la that's beautiful isn't it even if you just want to tie up presents with these ribbons they're beautiful ribbons to own beautiful ribbons to have even if you just plaited together three of these ribbons and made them into a little bracelet and just wore them see i think that looks awesome twist them together twist them together hang on that doesn't look very good because it's all unraveled but it's kind of twisting them together <laughs> trying to do it one, a one-handed jewelry make it just twisting them together plaiting them together making beautiful little ribbon bracelets there. I just, I just love these, Linda. They're beautiful, aren't they? Yeah, they, um, I did a necklace the last what? time I was on show with, with ribbon, with ribbon that was in the kit, and did that weave, the ribbon weave. I, I showed it on air. That would look yeah, stunning. Yeah, it was like a flat weave, yes, yes, wasn't that, it? That can go on our hair bands. Ah, bands. tiara yeah, bands, yeah. yes. Yeah, so, I mean, in those multicolours, wouldn't Ooh, that be stunning? Yeah, absolutely. I've got loads of you on the phone on there. We're going to have to, oh, my goodness me, we're going to have to move on. Ha! Ah! Ah! Ribbon! 100 metres of ribbon. I'll put that back in the bag quicker than your same bolt can run at the 100 metres. The <laughs> same bolt? He's pretty amazing, isn't he? How about a brand new strand? Another brand new strand of smoky quartz. Our final brand new strand of the day. Smoky quartz, smoky quartz, smoky quartz, smoky quartz. Are you feeling a little bit jealous of this strand, Linda? Because I know how you it's, feel about smoky quartz. Yeah, I know. I feel very, you know, if the smoky quartz said, I have to have it. And I know. It, it needs me. Now, it, Linda, it? you put kits together, you put boutique collections together. Um, what is one of the what is one of the um, what is one right okay start again carol <laughs> what gemstone do you always look for on the report which is a report of all the gemstone strands what what gemstone do you always look for on the report and it's never there well i look down all the quartz yeah and then i move over to the right and look for that word smoky and it's never there it's never there why is it never there because it just flies out because it building. just goes every single time we bring your smoky quartz on jewelry maker it sells out why it goes with everything it goes with everything this gemstone is one of the only gemstones that i think features in every single guest designer's top five gemstones i think it's one of the only gemstones that features in in, in every single guest designer's top five gemstones it goes with literally everything absolutely everything and i'll show you what it goes with in just a few seconds we're going to have to get a price out. I've got loads of you on the phone line to this. Here's your deal today for genuine smoky quartz wheels. Oh, my. You are brave doing that price point in front of Linda for smoky quartz. You are brave, Laura. She's very you brave because there's not going to be any left for me now. Well, sorry. Sorry, L Linda. So sorry. Sorry, Linda. And I love that cut as well. I don't know. Um... <laughs> there's Cassie's hand what price did you expect that to be Linda well if I'm truthful because it's the tassel strand I was thinking mm -hmm. probably around the 12.95 so did I yeah yeah okay not today 6.95 let's see what it goes with does it go with praise your light yes absolutely in fact that's a lovely color combination does it go with the eye light yes does it go with the multicolor beryl yes oh that's beautiful does it go with the amethyst we had on earlier? Yep. Does it go with the heliodor we had on earlier? Yep. Does it go with this pair of tweezers? Yep. Yes. It goes with literally 
everything everything you put it with it just goes with it beautifully it's the most amazing genuine gems and it will literally go with everything the phone lines have gone bonkers for this understandably and so have the web if you want to add more than one of these strands onto your order please 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 just go for it speak to the call center or life help and say i want four of those and they'll say well don't say i want four say please may i have four of those <laughs> and they'll say yes of course you can if the quantity is there you can add it onto your order no problem at all does it go with fluorite you betcha you betcha Carol, I call that the chocolate box gemstone because it Go goes with every flavour. Chocolate goes <gasps> every flavour. And Gee, smoky quartz goes with monkey. every flavour yeah. of gemstone, i.e. every colour. Definitely. She's right. The chocolate box gemstone. What are you always going to get in a box of chocolates? Chocolate. You're going to get loads of other flavours. You're going to get loads of other colours. You're going to get white chocolate, dark chocolate, uh, milk chocolate. You're going to get loads of different flavours, aren't you? But you always get chocolate. Yeah, and it works. I mean, let's face it, even salty caramel goes brilliantly with chocolate. So every single gemstone is going to go brilliantly with smoky quartz. Yeah, you're right, Absolutely. you're right, you're right. I've got loads of you on the phone lines there. There is a, uh, there is quite a significant queue on the phone lines now. Uh, but don't forget, if you are calling from a BT landline, the phone call's free anyway. Uh, this goes so beautifully with the ribbon. And do you know what else goes with the ribbon that we just bought you? This! Now, we just bought you an amazing bundle for um, Organza Ribbon. Literally just arrived in the building to, um, at half past ten this morning. Laura made Ed go up to the vault at the road and get it. He said, would you like some Organza Ribbon? I think even before you finish the sentence, yes, yes. Still out of breath. I know. Right. This would go with that organza ribbon deal, wouldn't it just? Fluorite drops. Now we bought you some fluorite drops yesterday and they flew out the door. Um, fluorite is one of those gemstones that comes in a whole variety of colors. As amethyst comes in every shade of purple, this gemstone comes in every shade of purple, yellow, green, blue, pink. It's amazing, isn't it? Some of them are banded, some of them aren't, some of them are more translucent, some of them have got great clarity, some of them have got um, um, hardly any colour, some of them are, are all about colour, some of them are bicoloured. It's the most amazing gemstone. When you get these near fluorescent lights, such as UV light, um, or if you're a clubber, um, then, um, then, uh, then this gemstone will glow. It's amazing, it will glow, it's amazing. So you're getting drops and you're also getting fluorite pencils. Have you seen these pencil shaped beads before, Linda? I have, aren't they? They're, they're really um, contemporary. Is the they are gorgeous, of. aren't they? So bring a gemstone into a contemporary shape. They are beautiful. Do you see the point of this strand? Point. <laughs> I actually do see the point of it, Carol, point. very much. Yes, yes. I, point. I, I see, yes. I, see. I have got um, lead in my pencil. I have my, I have my. Right, so you've got your fluorite pencils. <laughs> you've got your fluorite drops as well. Oh, she's feeling sharp today. <laughs> uh, right, so do get involved. A gorgeous, gorgeous bun here with your drops and your pencils. Here's your deal. See, it's the prices like this which just amaze me because you've got pretty much a custom cut strand of your drops of your of your uh, beautiful pencils and we dare to take it below 11 pounds that is just ridiculous isn't it what a price point Woo! well done i've got loads of you on the phone lines for this now well done what a stunning 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 two two strand bundle there just gorgeous well done loads and loads and loads of gorgeous colors in there beautiful varieties of clarities as well and you could graduate them as well what a lovely idea now Ah, the baby's coming. So, final, hey? Oh, gosh. It's not, no, it's not, don't worry. Oh, that's disappointing. No one wants to see that on air. Well, can we bring the cameras in? No, oh. Linda. I thought you For could. Pity you could be the first sink. lady to sing your way through labour. Do you know what? I'm, I'm definitely going to sing. <laughs> <laughs> right. Back in stock back in stock oh yes they're back in stock back in stock look at these they're back in stock back in stock the call cutters are back in stock woo, woo, woo. oh you're gonna miss me so <laughs> coil cutting pliers jump ring coil cutting pliers now debbie bulford one of our chainmail experts is always going on about how the fact that you need um saw cut jump rings to make your chainmail pieces um 
how satisfying is it to make your own findings? Really satisfying. How satisfying is it to make your own jump rings, which you do, which you can use not necessarily just for just for chainmail, but for any kind of pieces of jewelry where you're going to be connecting gemstones together. Really nice and satisfying. This tool comes with instructions on the back so it'll tell you how to use these core cutting pliers the only thing which you need to add to this is obviously some wire which we bought with some wire today actually and um and a saw as well which you can see here do be careful when you're using that don't let children use it obviously unattended um, so all you need to add to this is a saw and some wire let me take these out have you used these before linda yes i have they're yes. pretty no, kind they're of nifty, aren't they? Yes, they're. Inc I mean, really, it's simple for us to sort of look at that. And say, yes, that's a, a jump ring um, making tool. But when you think, whoever designed that, it's really clever. Laura really said that clever. she designed it. Oh, did she? Oh, I'm really clever, Laura. Really clever. You didn't design it, Laura. Stop lying. Why? Why are you bothering to lie? Why lie about something it's like that? It's a problem she has, isn't it? Fine. Right. You've got your core cutting pliers here. Sorry, your core, uh, yes, your core cutting pliers. So uh, they do come with instructions and, and give you instructions about how to make your own jump rings out of this. Um, it is a fantastic time-saving device. Now, lovely, lovely, lovely Laura Binding. She made her own uh, chainmail bracelet. It was either a bracelet or a necklace, I can't remember what it was, uh, for a kit on the Jewelry Maker show. It took her all evening to make the jump rings for that. Why? because she didn't use these pliers. She reckons if she had made her own jump rings using these cord cutting pliers, it would have cut the amount of time it took her to make the jump rings in half. Literally, she would have halved, it would have halved the amount of time it would have taken her to make her jump rings. In actual fact, she didn't have this tool and it took her all evening just to make the jump rings. Well, you don't want to be messing around making your own jump rings for an entire evening, do you? Um, because making jump rings isn't going to be the most isn't going to be the most creative thing in the world to do. So why not save yourself the time and get a pair of these pliers and make your own? If you're going to be even thinking about going on the chainmail course, or you want to uh, make your own um, you want to make your own uh, jump rings to use with chainmail or any project indeed, go for it because this is your deal today. It's a time saving device. This is what exactly what these tools are about. And today we're going to give you a great deal. Here it is, fourteen pounds ninety five p. I think that's amazing. I think that's amazing. I think that's just incredible. Do you know what? I'm thinking, I'm thinking about, right, okay. Time-saving devices. One of my best time-saving devices at home is my, is my blender, it's my food processor. If I was to make something from scratch, like a sauce or something like that from scratch, where you have to chop things up very, 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 very finely, it would take me double, if not, if not triple, the amount of time to make that sauce or to make whatever, whatever it is I'm making. In actual fact, I've got a food processor that cuts down on the amount of time it takes me to get to the end result, which is eating it, which is what I really want to do. When you're gonna be making your own jump rings, you want to physically get to the point where you're making the jewelry. You don't want to be messing around making your jump rings and taking hours and hours and hours. So it's exactly the same concept. Save yourself the time. Get over that bit which is quite technical and you know, and, and, you know can, can be quite time, um, 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 time consuming. Make them with a tool like this. It'll save you so much time, so much energy um, and so much hassle. And then you can get on with the fun, which is physically designing and making your pieces of jewellery. I think it's great. What a fantastic time-saving device. And it's less than £15. And these tools are designed to last. They are designed to last and last and last. Great quality, aren't they, Linda? Yeah, I mean, the thing is, is as well, tools. when you do do a chain mail piece, right? Mm. Um, and you think, well, I'll, I'll buy 200 jump rings. That will probably make you quite a simple bracelet. Mm -hmm. But if you want to really make a piece of a chain mail art really a yeah. nice piece of jewelry you're going to need a lot of jump rings so between two and three hundred jump rings i think at isn't minimum it? Yeah. yeah so if you've uh, if you've got that tool you know that you and you've got some wire you mm. know you're always going to have your jump rings to, to complete the the, uh, the piece that you're of working course, yeah. on yeah yeah exactly linda's right you know if you're going to be if you're going to be making your chain mail pieces and you're going to be kind of be um, she is always right you're quite right ryan um, and whenever we uh, you know if you are going to be making something which is a little bit more a little bit more advanced um you are going to need hundreds of jump rings we're not talking tens of jump rings hundreds of jump rings which is why tools like this have been invented to save you time because making hundreds of jump rings by hand is gonna take you forever it's gonna take you forever right last deal abalone then we're over to linda is that right 
Oh, I'll tell you what, Gherkin's giving me a good old kick today. <laughs> Very, very special deal here, very quickly for abalone. Abalone double-sided ovals, abalone double-sided squares as well. We had some abalone on the show yesterday. It flew out the door, which is great. Two strands of abalone. Here they are. Two strands of gorgeous abalone. One fantastic price. Gorgeous genuine gemstone strands here. Every single color of the rainbow represented. Every single color, it's there. It's looking beautiful. And this is your prize today for these squares and ovals of genuine abalone. $7.95. What are you doing with these price points, Laura? What are you, are you trying to just shoehorn these into the show just for the hell of it? Is that what you're trying to do? Shoehorn ridiculous price points into the show just because she can. Mark my words, Laura. I may only have three shows left after this, but just, just you be careful. They, might, they may not ask me back. They may not ask me back. Don't start blaming me for your price points. You're the one who presses the buttons. Right, well done, 7.95, great deal there. Right, another bundle, right. Very, 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 very quickly. Pink shell pearl, six millimeter rounds. Oh my word. Genuine freshwater culture pearl in lavender. <gasps> Genuine freshwater culture button pearls. Oh, this is beautiful. Button pearls, my favorites. Crackled white quartz rounds, blue chalcedony nuggets, and oh, this is so beautiful. Butterflies of rose quartz. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh, I oh, love it. Look oh. at this. Two strands of genuine freshwater culture pearls, shell pearl, crackled quartz, blue chalcedony, and butterflies. Limited in quantity. I can't wait to see how low this is going to go. You're kidding me. I don't know, Linda. I think she's lost it. I think she lost it a while ago. I don't think she ever had it, to no, be honest. No, I don't think she ever had it, to be honest. Butterflies of rose quartz. Two strands of pearls in lavender and in button qualities. Shell pearl, crackle quartz and blue cow suddenly. 19.95. That is amazing. Imagine the jewel you can make with that. That would mm -hmm. make a gorgeous challenge for you, Linda, today, exactly wouldn't it? Would. Loads exactly. and loads and loads of you on the phone. I said, don't miss out. Check out your basket as quickly as you can. Right. We're going to head over to Linda now. Can right, bring, come on, can, Gherkin. Can you bring that with you, Gherkin, please? Yes. Because I just want to see what it looks like with my children. I'll bring it over for you, Linda. Thank you very much, Gherkin. Here you are, Linda. I want to do it. Thank you very much. Thank you. Here you are, Linda. <laughs> this worked brilliantly. With Look that, at your jewellery, Linda. Oh, Beautiful. wow. Oh, I love that. Oh, oh. You are so talented, Linda. You really yeah, are. It's such a beautiful buns, as I say. If you've got that, or want, you need this one because whoa, oh, those button pearls are gorgeous. Whoa, button! But I like button pearls as well. They're mm. my favourites. This is gorgeous, Linda. Look at this beautiful necklace. Graduated necklace here. Don't forget, photos of all of this will be on our Facebook page after the show. But gorgeous graduated shell pearl necklace here. Look, can you see the silver mystic quartz at the top Pretty, here? She's been it? woven in. That's beautiful, Linda. Twelve ninety five for this challenge bundle. Gorgeous. <gasps> it's gone such a oh. long way. You've still got some left as well. Isn't that lovely? Yeah. Look at this ring. I love this ring. Did you have fun making? I did that? actually. I don't. I don't make rings very often. You don't often. really, do no, you? No, I don't. But um, oh, you should do that. That's and beautiful. And I saw that silver quartz. I thought that would look so pretty in um mm. in a ring. Lovely pair of earrings to go with the ring as well. Yeah, very simple, but uh, very very usable. That's Beaut the thing about the silver quartz, it's very usable. It is very usable, yeah. Very very usable. Very versatile. Lovely earrings here. Just using head pins and the shell pearl. Lovely bracelet that there. Just, just, you, I mean, a classic pearl bracelet. Yeah, is just, definitely. It's right there, isn't it? It's beautiful. And here's your little hair slide. Isn't that beautiful? I really enjoyed working today with that. So let's just. So this. So this deal is for the three strands of gemstones, the wire, and your five hair combs mm -hmm. as well. So that's amazing, isn't it? Yeah, I've got tons of wire left and I've got gemstones left too. And, and you've got four of the hair combs left exactly. as well. Exactly, yes. Oh, I just love this. It's so lovely, Linda. Thank you so much. And this bundle here, which oh, I just bought to you for 19 95 I know, aren't they beautiful? They go so they well with that. So, so beautiful. Oh, 
Linda, when are you back? I'm on back on Monday. With me? Yeah. We're going to do an art show on Monday. Uh, we're going to be wearing berets. Uh, we're going to have moustaches as well. So if you want to see Linda and I looking a little bit ridiculous, um, <laughs> tune in on uh, tune in on Monday. It is the art show. Uh, quite seriously, we've got some amazing kits there, we haven't have. we, for that yes, show? Yes, we certainly have. Yes, they are beautiful. They're all inspired by uh, by fantastic artists like Andy Warhol, uh, like Monet, and uh, Damien Hirst as well, uh, which is going to be really really interesting with his crystal his, his crystal skull. Uh, so we've got loads and loads and loads coming up on Monday show. Do make sure that you tune in for that. Tune in for the late show tonight between five and nine, um, and uh, tune in for tomorrow. We've got a shrink plastic special tomorrow and a live masterclass between two and three. Uh, um, uh, which is for Silver Clay as well. Thank you so much, Linda. You've been brilliant today. Thank you very much, Carl Sergio. Isn't she lovely? And congratulations to our Wall of Fame winner and runner-up yes. as well. Thanks a lot for joining us today, guys. See you in a bit and add as much as you can to your basket. Bye. Bye. Do you need a helping hand to get started with Jewelry Maker? Are you stuck for ideas and need inspiration? Then visit our Jewelry Maker website where you can find our video tutorials. Expand your knowledge and skills with these easy to follow jewelry making demonstrations. Whether you're a beginner, hobbyist or business owner, there's always something new to learn. It couldn't be easier. Simply click and learn some new jewelry making techniques. The Jewelry Maker Wall of Fame is where you get to showcase your skills as a jewelry designer. And each week, one lucky entrant will win £100 credited to their Jewelry Maker account, and the runner up receives £50. If you want to enter your design, just send a photo to studio at jewelrymaker.com. Or you can post your photos to Wall of Fame, The Genuine Gemstone Company, Unit 2D, Eagle Road, Moon's Moat, Redditch, B989HF. We all know you need the right tools for the job. So here at Jewelry Maker, we have designed a kit to make sure you have all the essentials to join in with the fun. With round nose, flat nose and wire cutter pliers, as well as a reamer, tweezers and a bead scoop, you've got everything you need in one place for just 9.95. We provide the tools, you provide the skills.